What is going on, everyone? Welcome to... It's Friday. And you know what? You know what's really bad? You know what's really bad? It's when the camera just doesn't decide it wants to work. Oh, look, there we go. Look, it's sideways. How good is that? Well, we're off to a, a rick rollicking old start, eh? That's better. Hey! Hey! Oh, what a cracker of a start. Oh, my God. I just realized when that timer was at about two minutes that I hadn't uploaded the video this morning. Oh, shoot me now. Unbelievable. For those of you who are waiting for Sam Lewis's contracts, they'll be up in 27 minutes. So you can go watch that if you want, in between. Yeah, after this even would be would be just well. Although I know those of you now, I know those of you who are actually watched to the end of videos. Now you can't hide because those of you who made comments saying, let's go to the, I don't know, whatever team, or oh, secret, spoilers. Um, I know you watched the end because I left it right till about the last 10 seconds of that video to be like, here is a little sneak peek at the, um, at the contracts. So those of you who stuck around right to the end of that video, well done. Uh, you got a little something special, special at the end uh, for your for your commitment to the video, shall we say? So well, bloody done to you lot for that. Uh, today, today is a glorious day because it's Friday. It's Friday. Uh, why we're we starting on the screen? I don't. I don't really know to be honest. Um, I haven't fixed the camera yet. I fixed it on one side and not on the other. What an idiot! <sighs> there you go. I've fixed it now. Good thing the microphone is separate, isn't it? It's a good thing about the studio mode on OBS, isn't it? It's, it's good, it's great, it works nicely, but if you forget to switch it from one scene to the other, it just does not work. But it's all right, because we've got a bit to talk about here. I started on this page here, because look, <laughs> look at what we've got up there, right at the top. Countdown to the Rugby World Cup. Yeah, I nicked it. I nicked it from these mugs. Well, I didn't nick the page, but I, I nicked the countdown. So now when we stream, you have a countdown to the Rugby World Cup. Woo! How exciting is that? Um, so cool beans. Cool beanos. We have got 21 days, 21 hours, 40 minutes, and zero seconds. Swish stuff. Tell you what, I'm on fire. I've got coffee in hand. It's scalding bloody hell hot. Um, and we're going to play some beer pro today. But um, what else we got to talk about, though? Uh, old Farrell, anyone? <laughs> uh, that little mug. You reckon he's going to get away with it? Who thinks he is going to get away with it from World Rugby? He sneaked past in the Six Nations, but World Rugby, I don't know. I don't know. We will see. We will see in time. So I'm curious everyone's thoughts on that, of course, obviously. Um, but yeah, typical. We kick things off talking about what's happened over the last few days. It's been a super busy week, hasn't it, of, of rugby news. Not only, like, the whole Owen Farrell thing, uh, but we've had so many more squads. Uh, like, the Romanians, uh, the, the Scots, uh, the Chileans. Oh, I've forgotten half of them. But, uh, yeah, it's been cool. We've had lot, all those teams kicking about now. So, yeah, half, half probably is, no, it's over half, I think of the World Cup squads have been named. So we are almost cooking to the full extent of cooking a Rugby World Cup, which is awesome. What other teams have we got this week? What other teams have we got? Romania we got, Scotland we got. We've already got South Africa last week. Uh, Australian rugby. What sort of disarray is Australian rugby in at the moment? Did anyone see Eddie Jones yesterday? His assistant coach has bailed on him. And he had an absolute meltdown at the airport at the media. Now, that was funny. If you've not seen that, go and find it on social media somewhere. It'll be on Twitter. It'll be on Facebook. It'll be on all those usual places that have, oh, what, a couple minute video. He just lost his marbles. And he told them they're all useless. <coughs> they're negative. Um, they should give themselves an uppercut. I'll tell you what, Eddie Jones is the entertainment that just keeps on giving. He really is. He really is. So yes, welcome on everyone to a Friday. Uh, what other teams did we get today uh, or this week? Not None from Paul D, bar the Wallabies. We got Chile. 
We got Argentina early. Oh, we got Japan, didn't we, as well? We got Japan. I think this pool was pretty much finished. What I thought would be cool would be like simulating. I haven't done the full squads yet on Rugby Challenge. I'm going to, when they're all named, I'm going to put the actual squads into the game and then um, simulate the World Cup. Before the World Cup starts, I know that's going to be pissing difficult. But uh, we're going to do it. And we're going to bring a highlights package. But I thought what would be cool to actually do that first. Like, just with the unedited teams. Just players that they've been using for all these years. Uh, in my months and squads that I've got. And just see who wins the World Cup. So we might, we might crack into that uh, first as a bit of a laugh before we play some beer pro. But um, as always... Happy Friday, and we'll crack into some, um, what are we cracking into? It's a rugby challenge, that's what we're playing. I actually fixed this, actually, I'm, I'm quite happy today because I actually fixed uh, the YouTube streaming. Oh, and actually, and actually, and before I go too far, for those of you who do subscribe or um, like the amazing support we had in the last stream um from dub if you subscribe if you member if you follow on twitch or youtube or anything all the alerts should be working all of the alerts should be working and dub i'm halfway maybe maybe halfway but i'm working currently on uh, a cool little what do you call a badge for you and we're going to get some emotes as well for the chat for those of you who are members on YouTube as well, so that's something worth looking out for. Um, but yes, we will have I will have some cool little badges and stuff for you, Dub, and anyone else who wants to chip in and get a, a cool little alert. I noticed we got one just before we started. Someone subscribed. It's like yes, it works. Woohoo! Success. So if you're not subscribed to the channel, uh, you can smoke that button, and hopefully something up here will pop up and go boo. And it'll play something, well, you won't find out until you do it now, will you? Those of you who are subscribed, well, yeah, you'll see it anyway. Someone might do it during, the, during one of these streams uh, as we go on. So, cracking into it. I want to do this World Cup thing. I actually want to do this World Cup thing. Um, so many rugby challenge games everywhere. I want to do this World Cup thing where we actually, like, mock a rugby World Cup. We got 21 hours and 21 days. Uh, 21 days and 21 hours, whatever way around you want to do it. Till this tournament starts. We almost have all the teams. If you want to know my quick thoughts, shorts. I'm doing a short for every team that's been named. I think I've still got Scotland to go and maybe one other. Just some quick thoughts about the team. So if you haven't seen those, check them out. Um, I'm going to try and make them a little bit flasher in the uh, in the coming days as well. What's up, Jack? How you going, dude? Good to see you, as always. We're going to be making a... You know, I, want to, I want to do a little mock World Cup. This should only take probably 10 minutes. Uh, if we do the pools and that all correctly. I want, to see, I want to see who would win. Completely simulated. Rugby World Cup. On the right pools, of course. With not the right squads, but we're going to... I just want to see what happens. And then we'll go back to old um, Maxi boy. See what? Okay, let's 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 do this. Let's do this just for fun, just for you know shits and giggles, as they say. Want to do a World Cup? Um, what's happening, Burn Cabbage? Good to see you. <laughs> Hello. I like to have your thumbs up. Cool. I want to get some cool. I'm gonna get some cool little. I don't know. Do, do we want like rugby orientated emotes or something? We we'll get something cool going on. I don't know the pools off by heart, actually. Let me um let me get the pools up and I'll I'll chuck them over here. And we're gonna make we're gonna make a, a a mock rugby world cup early and just simulate it and see what happens. Just out of complete curiosity. Twenty teams play each other once. Top two per pool. No one else advances. Grand final Japan. Whatever. Ah, oh, uh, where are we? France. I don't think I've got any French stadiums. Oh, well, nah. They're a bit shit, aren't they? Those French stadiums. I don't think I've got any other French stadiums. Stop me if you see one. But, um... I think it's like Argentina mostly, and those... No. Marvel, South Africa, Loftus, South Africa. Oh, maybe we just stick with Japan then. Whatever. Oh, these stadiums suck. Oh, well... 
No, let's do it properly. Let's go, let's go fresh to fish and win. Okay, we're going to go there. Four points for a win. Um, whatever, we have bonuses and stuff like that. Right, this is what... Right, right, let's do this properly, right? <laughs> right, 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 right. Right, New Zealand is, is number one ranked there. Uh, where's France? There's France. Uh, Italy, Uruguay, Italy. Do, 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 do. Uruguay. And who's fourth? Namibia. There they are. Look at that. Oh, they're, they're all in the right place. Uh, Paul B. Let's, let's switch it over. South Africa. Ah, there they are. They're already in there, but we've got to rank them properly. Ireland. I saw Ireland before. Oh, there they go. They're already in there. Uh, well, Russia's not here. That's all right. We'll deal with them later. Scotland. Um, Tonga. And Romania are not there. Neither are Canada, actually. So let's remove that team. Uh, and let is us add another team. So who are we looking for? Romania, aren't we? Uh, there they go. Right, Tonga, Romania. There we go. Paul B's done. I don't know what these teams are going to be like, by the way. I have not completely ripped them out. Wales. Australia. Fiji. Fiji's got a good team. I, I used them not long ago, and they were phenomenal. And Portugal. Instead of get out of here, USA. Portugal. Oh, Jesus. It skips half them out. There they are. Portugal. Right, now, Paul D, we have, of course, England at the top. Japan, wow, they're in order. Uh, Russia's not there, but Argentina can go. And Samoa are up there, and we'll get rid of Russia. And we'll put in Chile. Look at that, we've got them all. Right, now, this, here we go. This is Rugby World Cup 2023. Should we name it? Oh, we can't. Oh, we can. Oh, keyboard's on the wrong side. There we go, look at that. Now, let's see. Let us see. Everything's right, right? Right, right, right. The only difference is we're going to not see the crossover in semi-finals. So C and D are going to go right to the final. So you won't get that mix up. I wonder if you can change that. Uh, advance A. No, so it's top two. Okay. We don't, we don't have a B option. It's a shame we can't get... Uh, shame we can't change... You see, that is a nightmare. That is that is disaster. Goodness me, that is confusing as all hell. We'll go top two per usual. We just won't get that nice crossover in the semi-finals. Um, yeah, like we are in the proper World Cup. But let's roll with that. Have we created it? I feel like we have. What's happening, roll hit? Welcome along, buddy. We're making a um, making a mock World Cup. Doesn't matter what difficulty it's on. Uh, pff, automatic. Don't need auto save. We're just simulating everything. Can I go without a? I probably should pick a team, shouldn't I? Uh, let's let's pick a team that's going to get smoked out nice and early. Um, and does not matter. Right. So here we go. I could have gone through all the teams actually, and we could have um, simulated each and every game. Oh, we're simulating a World Cup for now. But we are going to play a proper World Cup when we have all of the teams, all 20 teams named. Um, we are going to do that. Simulation, of course. We don't we don't play the actual games because that's unfair. Unfair advantage. So here we go. Not the World Cup opener we thought we would get, but France. France and Italy have drawn. Ho, ho. The All Blacks have beaten Namibia. Scotland have downed Romania. Ireland over South Africa. Georgia have taken out Wales. I, I should do them each and every individual game. Italy have played game of the season there, haven't they? They really have. But they no, they don't have to edit every team. No, 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 no. We'll leave it like this. This way is fine. Um, but then we can't actually go through to the end one game at a time. Which is a shame. <laughs> you like the countdown? Not long to go. Not long to go. Hopefully, hopefully it stays in in sync because it has a habit of dying but we'll see how it goes wales with a one point win over georgia whoa -ho! and the wallabies have got up over portugal right we'll simulate our game um there against japan because we don't really care about that uh doo -doo -doo -doo. simulate that japan obviously getting the win no surprises there let's see what else has happened oh samara beating argentina ho 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 Okay, that was round one. Oops. So there's your full results of round one. 
Bit of an upset there. Bit of an upset here as well. A draw. 22-22. France and Italy. The hosts. Nothing else. Oh, actually, I didn't see that. Ireland beat South Africa. <gasps> Whoa. Georgia come within one point of beating Wales. And Samoa defeating Argentina. Huge, huge results there. What's up, North Melbourne? Welcome along, my friend. That chat slim somehow faded its way down there. Uh, what else we got? Round two. We've started round two. The All Blacks are in action. They've beaten Uruguay easily 39-15. France have disposed of Namibia. Ireland have beaten Tonga. South Africa have disposed of Scotland. Mm, interesting. Oh, <laughs> if this is a real World Cup, this would be amazing. This would be amazing. Fiji have defeated Australia in the second round of the Rugby World Cup. Georgia have smoked Portugal. Big high-scoring game, that one. England have downed Samoa. And then Argentina is up against Chile. So this is a good point to go here and have a look at the standings. Uh, let's pull four. We don't... Okay, we'll go back to A. Right. So France has drawn the game when they're still yet to play the All Blacks. New Zealand are 2-2. Two two. France have got a draw. No loss yet. Italy doing well. They've won game. They've had a buy in round two. They've picked up the draw. Uh, loss for Uruguay and Namibia. Okay. Pull... Oh, push the wrong button. Pull two. Pull B. What have you like? Ireland and South Africa are at the top. Ireland have won both their games, defeating South Africa. Scotland also, one and one. They did lose to South Africa, though. Uh, North Melbourne, there's one going up in about 10 minutes of just the contracts for those that missed it at the end of the video. For those those lowly scummers who didn't watch the very, very end. Now I know who watches to the end. Um, and yes, if you did comment on yesterday's video, you will get... Um, that, that counts, you know. God, I, I know that you guys are the good guys who watched the end. So, if you did comment yesterday, you're a champion, uh, you're a scholar, you're an exceptional human being, and I like you very, very much. Uh, but today is just a bit of a recap of the end of the season, another look at the contracts, uh, and just a, a bit of gibberish, really. The next proper one will start Monday, uh, some point Monday. Uh, I'll tally up all your guys' votes, and then we'll, we'll go to the next contract, and then we'll start the season, probably with the whole host of crappy preseason games, so... We'll see there. We might even play the crappy preseason games on stream. We'll see how we go uh, for that. But uh, yeah, Monday today, uh, 10 minutes today and on Monday. Right, back to this mock Rugby World Cup. Scotland in third. That's all right, Brent Cabbage. You, you can comment today if you want, or you can go back to yesterday's, or however you like, just what team. You guys will pick where we go. So it's up to you. Where we sign, if we stay at the balls, we go, who was it? Cheaters? Was it Cheaters? Melbourne? Pumas? And Drua? I think we're the four teams, or we stay at the Bulls. Something like that. There's a couple of NRC teams, a couple of Curry Cup teams, or we stay at the Bulls. That, that's the choices, pretty much. Um, at least we got contracts. I mean, we didn't get contracts on this series, the stream series of Max. What's up, Zeros? Hope you're doing well, dude. We are on the train to um, 30 followers on uh, Twitch, too. If you don't follow us on Twitch, uh, you can shoot over there and help us get the extra. We're not we're, we're 23 of 30. And something we've just started streaming on there. That's a good start. We've got a wee goal going on there. So you can you can just follow us on there if you like as well. Uh, why the hell not? It's probably better at alerting you of streams than YouTubers, but whatever. The Gendra, Bulls, Cheetahs, and I think it was the Pumas. I think it was uh, the, the Curry Cup Pumas. I think. I think. I could be wrong. Finally, in Pool B, though, the video will be out in nine minutes. It's 10 o'clock my time, so when it goes up, which is whatever nine minutes is in your time. Uh, Tonga and Romania are low, low down the pool here in Pool 2. Right, let's go pull three. Wallabies have lost. That's right. Now, this is the big one. Fiji has only played one game, and they defeated Australia. Georgia, woohoo! Georgia are second, but they've played two games. Uh, Wales down there as well as... Look at Georgia, though. Two bonus points. Uh, Portugal at the bottom. Right, last pull. Japan. Japan's top. Bonus point win over England. Samoa's played two games, one and one. Argentina have lost their only game so far. Wow. Chile down the model. Who cares about Chile? We probably should have gone Romania, to be fair. Anyway, 
that's our next game. We will simulate it because we don't care. Oh, we've been smashed. Absolutely smashed by the by the Argentinians. I thought Max would get a contract too, but we're into season two on Max and we've got nothing. I'm doing well, Zeros. Now my day's just started, mate. So it's like it's almost 10 a.m. here. So <laughs> on Friday. It's Friday. Uh how are you doing, dude? How's your how's your day been? I suppose you're at the end of your day. Which is cool, because we can chill for the end of your day, start of my day, fire it up, it's a Friday. Uh, Fridays are cool. Fridays are cool. And Zeros is cool, because he follows us on, on Twitch, so he's a champion man. Champion, man! We play England last. Now let's see what else happened. Right, that was our game there, 53-7, we got smashed. It's still Thursday in South Africa. I think it's still Thursday in, well, not all the world, but most of it. Most of you Northern Hemisphere people, a nice, nice Friday, Thursday evening stream. Gotta love it. We got smoked by Argentina there. Right, what else happened? There's some big games coming up here. Some really big games. <laughs> Seven minutes till Friday. All right, there you go, North Melbourne. Um, at midnight your time, the video should go live. Enjoying your vacation, Zeros. What? Vacation? Are you away or are you... A staycation? Or what are you doing? Gregor, it's... Yeah, you're right. It, you know what a rugby challenge is like? It never, it never fully puts the teams in the right place. You pick the final stadium. And other than that, it's just they play at their own stadiums. But that's, that's the best we can get, buddy. It's the best we can get. Uh, the video is going to be... Uh, it's about 8 or 10 minutes, I think, North Melbourne. Not very long. Not a huge one. Just a little short one of contracts and, and a bit about uh, some mail items, which you'll see um, as well. The final will be neutral, uh, but the squad's aren't even right. This is just a, a little bit of a play around. Uh, I thought it would be funny to start the stream off uh, to see who would win this little mock World Cup. <laughs> Six minutes. You're right. Six minutes is the time. Right, Italy, Italy have defeated Namibia. France has smoked Uruguay. South Africa's back on the winning track. Scotland has sneaked past Tonga. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Portugal have gone down to Wales. Not many upsets here. Fiji beating Georgia, though, might be considered that. And Argentina have snuck their way past Japan. <laughs> you got to watch both of them. Oh, you're on uh, holiday from your classes. Sweet, what city? What's where are you? Zeros. You're on, are you literally on holiday? Oh, September's next month, though, isn't it? So it's not too far away. Go, on, we enjoy going out for a walk in the city. Sweet, man. I like going on holiday. I want to go on holiday again. <laughs> Gotta watch both at the same time. Uh, and we're next, though. We are next. Well, that should be entertaining. Watching both at the same time. Oh, holidays are great, man. What are you studying? I always find it intriguing what people study. Right, we are up against England. This will be a this will be this will be painful, but it's all right. It's just chilly. Oh, 38 nil. Ouch. Uh, we do have one last game against Samoa, however. But what else happened? What else happened since this 38 nil rollicking? Oh, France have beaten the All Blacks 29-25. You saw it here first. You saw it here first. Yes, it's round four, but it doesn't matter. This World Cup is wide open. It really is wide open. Italy have beaten Uruguay. Ireland have beaten Scotland. Tonga have downed Romania. Australia have smashed Georgia. That is surprising. Fiji have beaten Wales. Fiji are through. Fiji are through. They're done. We're taking on Samoa, and then England will play Japan. Right, now, I want to see these tables. We've got one game left here. May matter. But um, then we have the final round. Intriguing stuff. Right, let's have a look at, not the schedule. I'm, a, I'm annoyed it's going to go right to the end and show us the winner. But um, we can't get around that. Right, pool one. So France have drawn with Italy, but then they've beaten the All Blacks. And, of course, they've, they've, they're done, actually. They are done. The All Blacks have one game to play. They could finish on equal points, but they probably won't. Which team does the All Blacks play this weekend? They don't play this. I think next weekend they play South Africa and Twickenham. 
And that's that's it. You're in high school and study physics, chemistry. Bloody hell, Zeros. You're a smart cookie, aren't you? Smart cookie in the Twitch chat. Physics, chemistry, dude. That's some high-end stuff. Good on you. Good on you. You're going to be a, a, a well-educated um, physical chemist. Honestly, mate, I don't even know what it does, but it sounds bloody impressive. I'll give you that much. Well done. Good on you. Good luck. Uh, Gregor, you're right. It's been a sellout for weeks, weeks and weeks ago. Uh, that game was a sellout, which is impressive. I, I don't know if we're going to see the best team, so... Are we going to see the best Springboks and the best All Blacks? Uh, Zeros, it, we in New Zealand, because of our summer, our summer is over the end of the year. So most of our classes run from like February, if they're a full year one, till like November, December-ish. So you get literally the year. Because our summer, your summer holidays are over Christmas, New Year period, so... We don't, we don't uh, chop it off in the middle of the year like uh, America does and places like that for our summer vacations. But you've got it sorted though, dude. Living life to the best. Love it. Gregor, you've got a ticket for it. Oh, you lucky, you lucky swine. Don't think the best teams will play. No, I, I don't think so either. There's too much of a risk. Too much of risk of players getting injured, I reckon. No one's, uh, especially after what happened to Intermac, uh, and what's happened to Van Portvelt, and what's happened to uh, Cyril Bailey. Like so many guys now have injured, have got injured, and are out out of the World Cup or or suspended. Owen, Owen, you're joining that list, Owen. Uh, it's too risky. If you've got good depth, then okay. All good. Or if, if you're not that strong in that position, well, who really cares? But, boy. Same for us versus Samoa. Samoa will be a, a tough game. A very, very tough game. For anyone. In a, in a build up to a World Cup. Because they are physical and they are tough. They are very, very tough. I don't know, uh, North Melbourne, we'll see how many we'll get through. We'll smack, smoke through this and see who wins this hypothetical World Cup. And then, I don't know, we'll see. We'll, we'll go for the usual three hours or so. We'll watch that timer, about midday, my time. Another couple of hours or so, and we'll go from there. Zeros, you're ahead of me, my friend. You're doing... I'm in between doing stuff, so this is what I'm doing at the moment. I'm just... I'm living life. <laughs> I'm just chilling out. Uh, in between, in between working environments, to say that much, eh? Nothing wrong with a pink coffee mug. Don't know why. I just grabbed the first one off the shelf. So pool one is very interesting. Italy, Italy have a chance they could top all the All Blacks out of this Rugby World Cup, hypothetically. Oh, there you go. It's one minute past. Video will be up. <laughs> Ireland are at the top of pool two. South Africa's there as well, as expected. Scotland, not quite. No, they are out of the mix. Yes, Scotland are gone. Uh, Tonga's... Yeah, okay, so that's pretty much sorted as well. Pool three, Fiji. <clears throat> Fiji are doing it. The video should be out. Let me make sure. Let me make sure. It should have been out earlier, but I forgot to I forgot to tick a box. Yeah, it's out. It's out, it's done, it's live, and it is away, and it is yours to view. Anytime you'd like. It's only a short one though. What is it? Eight Nine minutes. So not too long. But pool three though, pool C is the place to be. This is the place to be. Fiji, top of the table. Wallabies in second. Gregor's already watched it. How he's watched a nine-minute video in two minutes, I don't know. But he's, he's an amazing man. He is, he is spectacular. What's up, Neon? Welcome along, my friend. Uh, we have 
this is an interesting pull. Wales and Australia are one point difference. And I don't know who they play. Georgia's done. Portugal is, is done as well. We're going to see who plays that game. And here in pool four or pool D, it's pretty much done. England is uh, next up to play Japan. That will decide this pool pretty much. So let's let's simulate through the final. Oh, actually go to the end of the World Cup, won't it? Because it's our last game. And then we have to watch our way through. Where's this game? Where's Australia? Oh, they play each other. Oh, they play each other. <laughs> oh, that's where we decided. Oh, why didn't we do it so we can simulate game by game? Oh, well. Thanks, Neon. Glad you like the videos, buddy. Try to, We try to do stuff daily. We'll have games. Actually, this weekend, we'll have games. A couple of the build-up games. Well, England's, England's playing someone. South Africa's playing Wales. I think we'll do that. And um, there's another one. Can't remember who it is now. Or is it Ireland? Ireland's playing. I'm going to have to look at I'm going to have to... Jeez, you guys, you're just way ahead of me. You're all way ahead of me. Who is it? Yeah, Wales, South Africa, oh, Ireland and England. That's <laughs> I know the two of them forgot they're playing each other. Ireland and England. So that's we'll crack into that one too. That'll be this weekend. That's your content for the uh, weekend, right? Let's let's um <coughs> let's get through this. Watch this. We're gonna go right to the end now. It's a shame it's gonna show us who won. Ireland won the World Cup! <gasps> Why can't I go back? Why can't I go back? Oh, I can't view the matches! Oh, Ireland won! Well, we buggered that up. We buggered that up so badly. We should have picked every team. Ireland won the World Cup. There you go. So the first mock. <laughs> I thought I'd be able to view the fixtures. How dumb is that? Oh, well. Not to worry. Ireland did it. There's some upsets on the way. Oh, jeez. We'll, 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 we'll have to do that again and go through, like, as every team. Once we have all the sides. Would it happen twice? <clears throat> Would it happen? Likely. Whoa. Hang on. Automatic squad management. Well, we put it on, like, normal, because that AI plays the best on normal. Let's do this, then. Oh, what? You can't pick more than eight teams? Oh, for goodness sake. Okay, let's just pick the good teams, then. The good teams are going to make it to the end. Should our fans put a bet on ITV? <laughs> oh, imagine if... They could. I mean, they could. Let's be honest. I want to know who they beat in the final, though. That's so annoying that I can't view that. That's six. Who else are the big teams? Well, one of those are going to go through. Uh, what else we got? Top two teams in each pool, really. Have I only got seven? Screw it. We're going with Fiji. Bro, I want to do this again. Right. Where I can actually view every game. Right, we'll simulate that one. Oh! Look at that! They actually put the schedule around the right way. New Zealand defeated France in the only game of the World Cup. Yes, they did it right! Italy took out Namibia. Why can't you simulate from this screen? It would be way better. That's a good start. Why can't I simulate from here? Oh, I can do this. Oh, can I do that? No. Oh, I can. Okay, let's simulate through there. There we go. This is better. This is way better. Right. Ireland has beaten Romania. Good start. Tong has beaten Scotland. Look out, Scottish fans. Look out. Scotland have gone down in a heat to the Tongans. Okay. Australia, Georgia. Wallabies get the job done. Wales and Portugal. Wales win. Samoa beat Chile. Good work. Next up, England, Argentina. Oh, the English do it. 18-13. This is much better. This is way better. Why didn't I do this first time? Right, Uruguay went down to Italy. No surprise there. Right, let's go to this one. Namibia, New Zealand. 
41-18. Easy. South Africa, Scotland. Oh, the Scots. Oh, the Scots. What are they doing? They lost to Tonga and then they've beaten South Africa. What are they doing in Scotland? Bloody hell. Incredible. Tonga beat Romania. Man, I want to see these pools. Jeez, this is crazy. Right, Fiji, Wales. This is a big one. Oh, Fiji have done it as well. Portugal have gone down to Georgia. We'll go to this game. Japan, England. Oh, Japan have beaten England. It's Bedlam. Argentina have beaten Samoa. Oh, my goodness me. It is cracking off here. Okay, France aren't even in the top two in pool one. The All Blacks are top. We're halfway through, almost. Tonga are top with two wins. They've beaten Scotland and Romania. Incredible. Scotland a second. Where's the, the... Oh, I didn't pick Argentina. Okay, I was going to say I missed one of the top teams. Uh, Wales and Australia are top. Fiji, though. Possibility that it's, Wales have lost. Four, this is anyone's group. This is anyone's World Cup. Right, let's get back to it. It's more fun watching these games. Incredible stuff. France have beaten Namibia. New Zealand have smashed Uruguay. Ireland and Tonga. Tonga have beaten Ireland. Oh, look at that pool. Oh, look at that pool. Tonga top of the table. Imagine if this happened in real life. 2018 all over again. <laughs> oh, my God. South Africa need a win. They've got no points. They've only played one game. Scotland fading. Ireland back in the mix. Romania's out of it. Tonga, though, three from three. They're done. They're in the next round. Woo, this is amazing. Romania, South Africa. Okay. Springboks get the job done. Australia, Portugal. Wallabies get the job done. Fiji, Georgia. This is a big one. This is actually a really big one. Because they are both sitting mid-table. A big win here will catapult the team up. I have to go all the way down to this game. Right, we get three matches. Oh, Georgia with the win. Georgia have toppled the Fijians. Argentina's taking out Chile. And Japan has beaten Samoa. Wow, this is, this is incredible fun. Right, Italy, New Zealand. Oh, the All Blacks survived by a whisker. 32-29. That's amazing. Oh, take a breath. This is incredible rugby. Uruguay versus France. Oh, Uruguay beat France. What the hell? How is that possible? Scotland have beaten Romania. France, are France gone? Poor. Comes down to the last game. I tell you what, this is incredible. South Africa, Ireland. This is a big one. Oh, okay. Springboks. Get the job done. But South Africa is still struggling here. I'll add your vote to the mix. North Melbourne, if you haven't commented, if you have commented, then I'll add your vote to the mix <laughs> on there as well. <clears throat> Those who tuned into the uh, yesterday's one and voted there are, are extra special voters, though. Let's be honest. This World Cup's incredible. Upset City. What's next? Okay, so South Africa have beaten Ireland. <sighs> this is Uruguay and France. Come on. Right. Wales and Georgia. Massive game here. Oh, Georgia have done it again. Georgia have done it again. This is incredible. Georgia's top of the table. Who is going to join them? They're done. They're through. They're in. Australia still have two games. But Wales with only one game to go can't pass them. Fiji, two bonus point wins could equalize them. It's still close. It's still close. Japan for the win, maybe. Japan? Where's Japan? Oh, Japan are right in there. Two games on nine points. <laughs> England, England are fading. Argentina top. This is incredible World Cup. I think Fiji will beat Australia in real life too. Gee, Japan going all the way, Neon. You're not wrong. They're going well. This pool is crazy. Italy, France has capitulated. No and they've gone to crap. Tonga and Scotland lead pool B. Ireland and South Africa are struggling. They're both not going to make it now. Tonga's in. Same thing with Pool C. Georgia's done. They're gone. They're in. Far out. Let's get back to the action. Fiji. Oh, this is the big one you're talking about. Fiji, Australia. Neon. Ah, uh, North Melbourne. Woo, let's go. Who's going to do it? Who's going to do it? 
the, you're the legends, North Melbourne. You guys are the legends for tuning in and watching and, and hanging. I'm just an idiot who looks excited about rugby. Australia have been Fiji. So that puts the Wallabies now right in the mix. One point behind Georgia. Still a game to play. Fiji now, they're gone. And it seems like Georgia and Australia will be the teams to go out of pool C. Seeing Wales and Fiji. Fiji right out of the mix here. Still a game to play. Wales could be knocked all the way down to fourth. That would be spectacular. Right. England and Samoa are next. And we've got okay a couple of games here of some minnows. Japan, Chile will be a big one. Now, let's see how these goes. England. Big game here for England. Oh, Samoa. Samoa have done it. They've beaten England. Two losses. Samoa are through. Surely Argentina could pip them, though. Japan, game to play. Oh, this is incredible. 14 points. Portugal and Georgia will be a great game. Oh, there's so many great games. And the more that players get injured or suspended or left out of teams and stuff like that, the, the better the, the World Cup's getting. I'll tell you what, it's, it's insane. How good would this be if England got fourth? Game to play, four points behind third. They cannot qualify. They cannot qualify. What else happened? Namibia beat Uruguay. That's a surprising result. And Japan, big win over Chile. Right. Italy, France. This is huge. This here, Italy, France. <laughs> You're not wrong, North Melbourne. Every game will be great. Italy, France. This is to decide second place in the pool. Oh, France have died. France have just lost the plot here. Like at their home World Cup, they're going to go one and three. Italy go through anyway. Regardless, they've done the job. Well done. South Africa, Tonga. Job done for the South Africans. We are in the final round here. Scotland, Ireland. Has this got anything riding on it? Ooh, it, oh, it does. It does for Scotland. Ireland are gone. Scotland, though, could finish equal points or one above if they get a bonus. If they get a bonus. This is a huge game. Tonga could fall out. France went on strikes here. Yeah. That's the randomness about simulating the, the games. You know, you just never know. You don't know who's going to turn up. Scotland win. They're in for mix. If they lose, they're done. Oh, they won. No bonus point, though. So, oh, they got top. How they get top, though? I guess it must be not points differential because they're the worst. Ireland are gone. Tonga. Tonga 3-1. and one. Don't qualify. That is remarkable. And then Ireland, down to fourth. Useless. Absolutely garbage. What a World Cup this has been. What a World Cup. What's going on here? What's the next game? Fiji, Portugal. Fijians are done. Uh, this is the big one here. It's not actually going to decide anything. Australia are in. It, 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 pool C is done. We don't need to watch that or that. Uh, but we'll tune into Japan versus Argentina. Big win for the RGs. Wallabies over Wales. Uh, and Fiji with a one-pointer over Portugal. Wow. That got close very quickly. <laughs> Rugby's the best sport. When in places like this, North Melbourne, you're not, you're not far off. What's happening, Dear Hunter? <laughs> we're, we're, we're simulating through a World Cup, and this is... Wow, look at these tables. It's just stupid. It's just stupid close. We've just had... What do we have? The Wallabies pipped it. Uh, but Japan and Argentina... Just took place. And they are the top two teams. It solidified their place in the uh, playoffs. 14 and 15 points. England gone. How about this? England out. They are gone. Uh, Samoa finishing third. Uh, Chile fourth. Bad World Cup for the Northern Hemisphere. I'll tell you what. When England are gone here, Wales are gone down to fourth here. Georgia shocking the world to finish second over Fiji and Wales. Uh, and then we've got uh, Ireland who finished fourth as well. Scotland topping the pool. Bizarre. South Africa getting in second. As a South African, I have to be honest, I have a feeling the All Blacks will win the World Cup. The All Blacks have probably got the least troubles, I think, of other teams building up. But they've still got a game to play. And they've got a tough start to their group. So, I don't know. The Finn, these are crazy. These are crazy, crazy results. Oh, we could... We can we can play AI versus AI, which is what I'm going to do when we've got the full squads and put it into a little video series of like all the uh, pool one results and and stuff like that. So, but that would take literal 
days. Highland one win. <laughs> uh, that's what's crazy. This World Cup is crazy. It's crazy. Tell your fin, it's gone bananas. France have been knocked out of their own World Cup. Italy, yeah, it's really crazy. So we've actually only got um, <clears throat> one game left. Also, yeah, you won't be able to simulate all of these games because you can only pick eight teams. Ireland didn't qualify. So how do we move on next here? Okay. This is our last game of the round. I can simulate this one. England, big win over Chile. So let's have a look. Let's have a look at the competition. Bonkers. <laughs> so here's the final standings of the pools. New Zealand and Italy go through the, uh, the quarterfinals. Topping the pool on 19 and 14 points. Undefeated the All Blacks. France miss out with a 1-3 record with Namibia and Uruguay. That that's that's insane. That is absolutely insane. Pool B, Scotland top the table. But look at this. Three teams on 14 points. Scotland, South Africa, and Tonga. You gotta feel sorry for the Tongans, who despite a 3-1 record at the World Cup, go through. Or they don't go through, I should say. Ireland, just seven points, which is crazy. And Romania foot the bottom of the table. Just insane pull. Pull C. See Australia go through. No surprise there. But Georgia alongside them. Fiji third. And Wales out in fourth. Portugal rounded out with a 0-4 record. Pull D. Argentina at the top. And they have... <laughs> Rugby 24, you mean North Melbourne. Surely. <clears throat> That's um that's the one coming out next month, which we've still heard nothing about, by the way, as every time we stream. Argentina topping Pool D. Japan, <clears throat> shocking the world. One point adrift. Argentina, Japan. Samoa will get third. England, fourth. Two wins, two losses. Three bonus as well. They look, well, they're out. They don't look anything. They're gone. And Chile, fourth. Chile are getting fourth. They'll drink it before it goes cold. Goodness. Right. <clears throat> We've got quarterfinals here, team. We've got New Zealand, Japan. We've got Australia, South Africa. We've got Argentina, Italy. And we've got Scotland v. Georgia. What a intriguing little set of matches there. Let's get in. It's a shame we don't have the South African one last. But we'll go straight to semifinals. We should actually, out of all the eight teams I picked... Out of all the eight teams I picked here, only two of my eight have made it. Oh, sure, I picked Australia. I did pick Australia. Okay, three. Argentina, I did not pick. Right, so let's see. Let's see how we go. Game one. Let's go back here and do it. Quarterfinals. Oh, my God. 12-11. What a result. What a result. Who saw that coming? 12 and 11, the All Blacks over Japan. Far out. That is incredible. Game two. Wallabies, South Africa. Oh, quarterfinal two of the World Cup. Oh, the Wallabies have done it. Eddie Jones and his crazy talk has knocked out the Springboks. Oh, my goodness me. New Zealand's playing Scotland in the semi-finals, but that obviously means that Scotland defeated Georgia. Convincingly, 40 points to 29. Where's the Scottish guys in the chat? Where are they? We normally have at least two or three of them in the chat. Um, <clears throat> they're nowhere to be seen, but their Scotland team is, is killing it. Argentina defeated Italy, so we have our final four. We're going to have, well, we could have either two teams in the final, or we have none. New Zealand versus Scotland, Australia, Argentina. <sighs> this is insane. Oh, there we go. Neon's part Scottish. There we go. We've got a fan for Scotland. Can they do it? New Zealand, Scotland. Semi final of the Rugby World Cup. Oh, Scotland have done it. Oh, they've done it. 18 15, Scotland are in the World Cup final. Up against them. Australia versus Argentina. Hold on to your hats. This is a debutante World Cup final appearance for Scotland. 
up against them will be. Oh, it's the Wallabies by a single point. This is crazy. Australia v Scotland World Cup final. Oh my goodness me. Do we play this game AI versus AI? Or do we just simulate it? Do you guys want to see a World Cup final between Australia and Scotland? AI, no control, and see what they do. What a World Cup it's been. <laughs> Watch it. All right. <clears throat> All right, let's do it. World Cup final. Okay. I don't know what teams are going to be playing either. I have no idea. <clears throat> although, although, I did do Scotland games versus France. So they should be pretty up to date. And of course, yeah, Australia from the rugby championship. So they should be actually pretty up to date teams. This is it. <clears throat> this is it. Rugby World Cup final. We'll leave it on normal because that just gives you the most bizarre results. It's night. It's overcast. Let's roll. Let's roll. This is going to be crazy. This is a World Cup final. Scotland versus Australia. Let's do it. Cold coffee and all. I'm glad one of my eight teams I picked made it to the end. Let's go. Let's have a look at the team. I don't need to actually need to control it. Grand final, the Rugby World Cup. Scotland versus Australia against all the odds. How do they get this far? Eddie Jones, he's got his lucky cat going there in the box. He's, he's looking to do the unthinkable. Here's the teams. Nothing too exceptional. Gordon versus Russell, that'll be a battle. Horn versus McDermott. Don't look to be too many injuries. The back three will be exciting. Uh, Bell. Angus Bell is on the wing. What the hell? They are obviously hammered by injuries. They must be. Karevi and Pattaya in midfield. The one I need to ask you, Hodgie's in. Hodgie's been called up. Didn't make the squad, but he's been called up for injuries. Tupo, Bureki. Right, there you go. There's a quick look at the teams. Extra, oh, this could go anywhere. This could go to extra time. It could go, who knows. I didn't look at the teams close enough to know the players, but we are underway very quickly. Angus Bell is on the left wing, so tell me what is going on. I don't know. Let's look out for number 11. He's going to be a bulldozer. They're swinging it. There we go. Since when was Angus Bell this fast? Inside ball for the Wallabies. And Tate McDermott will grab the opening try. We've got a one on the board already. Scotland with very little possession. And Tate McDermott grabs the opening try. 5-0. Wallabies strike first. Not the start that the Scots had in mind, that's for sure. Who made that big break? It was Angus Bell on the left. Hell, I don't know. How that's even a thing. <laughs> Best games are the ones that go to sudden death, I tell you. That's the games. So Reese Hodge has got the kicking tee. All these squad selections are on automatic. So who's playing? No idea. But Reese Hodge has put over the extra two. It's Wallaby 7, Scotland 0. Early in the World Cup final. Can the Wallabies grab their third Rugby World Cup? Or will it be Scotland in their first appearance to grab William Webb Ellis, number one? There could be a turnover here for the Scots. Oh, they just didn't dedicate the numbers. We got seven minutes in, very early. Tate kicks ahead, actually. This will be a chance now. King Horn will run it from the back. He's kicked. Why has he kicked that? Pointless down to Hodge, who will return it into touch. Scotland get a set piece. They're going to try launch something from this. Let's see what they can do. Line out. Just inside the Wallabies half. Taking their time here. Oh, just, just got by Scotland. And Horn goes for a brief little run. Very hard to hold on to the ball there, Scotland. Had to battle for it. There's a gap. They're straight through. Can they link up? Oh, he can't find support. 
He needed to run the man on his left shoulder. Near the 22, great run. Right on the 22 now, Scotland. Off floating, through they go. Oh, he's gonna score it. What's he doing? Gonna get it down, oh, he's booked to the try. What's he done? The AI are just so dumb sometimes on this game. Both of them were over the line and they ended up kicking it. Eddie Jones breathes a sigh of relief. The walkie-talkie lives for another two minutes at least. As Reese Hodge kicks out. Oh, massive hole. Scotland are tearing this game apart. They've got to score this time. They need numbers though. No one's jumping the breakdown. Short side, there's room, there's numbers. That's a good bust, five meters short now. Scotland looking for the answer. Scotland looking for the reply to bring them back on level. Little bust from Horn, he's got the try. What? <laughs> what is going on? Why is this game so broken? He got it down. Scotland have been robbed. Not for the first time against the Wallabies in a World Cup, that's for sure. They go to the right wing. It's Stain down the left right side. Oh, he's put down. He just couldn't get the finish. Kyle Stain down the right wing. Oh, this is edge of your seat, riveting rugby. It's 21 minutes gone only. Parecki to throw. Just gets his man in the middle. Surely they'll kick this way. Nope, Gordon decides to pass instead. He leaves it to Hodge. Who's kicked it away from the chasing King Horn? Who's got trouble? Oh, Wallabies everywhere. He might see. Tell me he dropped that. What? It was a great try, but the Wallabies find their way back into the game. Scotland need the turnover. They need the ball. Wallabies very quick on the ruck. Oh, they've got numbers out here, the left side. Bell gives it out to Gordon. Gordon with one man to beat. King Horn won't be beaten on the step inside. But the Wallabies hot on attack. Scotland under immense pressure. Tate McDermott looking for a double. He's scrubbing it in behind. And it'll go down and go. This is tense stuff, man. I hate those grubbers. That's one thing I hate about this game when it's AI controlled is the grubber kicks. They are garbage. They are trash. They never come off, especially the forward ones. When they do it on the angle, they sometimes do. 22 dropout. Easily claimed on the chase from the Wangani Tawasi. Wallabies shifted to the left. They're very quick on the rock, the Wallabies. Scotland Release. struggling, struggling just to slow them down, let alone get possession. They keep it short and Fureki goes out wide. Here's the Wangani Tawasi. He's a danger man. Wrapped up. I expect that's Van Marver out there. Oh, pick and go. Smoked. Wallabies 40 out. Advantage. Oh, knock on. Knock on. Now's the chance for Scotland to counter-attack. Advantage on their side. And look at them go. Straight away. Advantage they over. put the foot down. And Scotland will score a counter-act play. That is a great start to hit back. The Scots are on the board against the mistake of the Wallabies. They hit back in an instant. And a try is scored by Sione Tupulotu. Great timing there at the bottom. That is exactly what they needed. Well picked up. Trekking across, and look at this. Straightens the line, bang, straight through. Five Wallabies defenders, if not six. And then the outright pace, no fullback in place, of course, on the attack. The Wallabies can't turn it around quick enough. And just like that, Scotland are back in the game. Finn Russell looks nothing like Finn Russell, but we'll live with it. He needs this kick, though. Oh, he's got it as well. He has got it as well. All tied up as we head towards halftime. <laughs> Can't the countdown time go fast quicker to the World Cup? Well, it could. We can make it quicker. It doesn't mean it's going to start any sooner, though. Reese Hodge launches play back underway. Scotland down in their own territory. It looks nothing like Finn Russell. We have to keep things, keep people guessing here. Come on. Ball is cleared away. Hodge at the back. I think Hodge is left footed. I don't know if he is on here, but it's a good chase and a good tackle. Taking Hodge over the sideline. Chance for Scotland to strike again. Well, they 30, 35 metres out. 
Oh, stolen lineouts. <laughs> we'll get to your comment in a, in a second. There's the Wallabies. Find their way backwards. They've locked it on again. Oh. It'll be the end of the half. It'll be the end of the half. Mistake from the Wallabies. It was a foul back to McDermott. Got smoked from Russell. Offside position. That should be that should be a penalty. The reason we're wearing the Patriots shirt is because I was in New England. When you're in New England, you've got to buy something, don't you? I'm not a Lakers fan, but I brought a Lakers shirt. Right, this is half time of the Rugby World Cup final. And this is the Wallabies with the better of the team, the better of the match by a whisker. 55% possession, a couple of handling errors. Scotland more line breaks though. This is a close one. A very, very, very close one. Half time, 40 minutes to play, 7 7 the score. Can Scotland shock the world? The fact they make this far, oh, defeating the All Blacks, knocking the ball on around the halfway line. Swinging it to the left here. Wallabies going to Angus Bell on the left wing. Why he's there, I have no idea. Pick and go from Tate. Offloads. McDermott very much in the mix here for the Wallabies. Doing all the hard work. Pick and go against Scotland. Turnover. Now they can run it back. Stepping props. What next? Oh, what not? Oh, I forgot it was a knock on. I forgot it was a knock on. Why did they let the play go on that long? I don't know. Find. Normally Six. they end it like instantly. First scrum of the match and we are 45 minutes in. That's bizarre. Right, McDermott. Gordon. Advantage. Around the corner, knocked on from Bell. It, it just feels weird to say Angus Bell is on the wing. Why they've done that, I have no idea. Set play from the Wallabies. Look at them, they got all fancy. Mc McDermott went to Crouch. Gordon, who went round in a little Find. circle and tried to pirouette some crap to Angus Sit. Bell. Did work. Did not work. Let's see if Scotland can launch something from their scrum set piece and set. We've had two scrums in three minutes, and they are. Ooh, this is going to be interesting. Let's see what they do. Russell gets the ball, and he, he stops. He's kicked it. Intriguing. And it's found touch. King Orn was chasing that hard, but it was never going to be in their fan. Wallabies, though, under pressure. Close to their own line. 25 out. Pareki. Oh, just manages to pluck it. Gordon through Karevi. Out wide. Long leads was it. Back in field he goes. They go back towards traffic. That's a shocker. Police. Scotland wrapped that one up too easy. It's 7 7. Bell scores the winner. Well, here he is. He's on the ball now. He's not very fast to start. Once he gets. How does he kick that well? Since when can Angus Bell kick like that? It's a cracker of a kick. It's put massive pressure on into the end goal. Didn't you not put that down? Crouch. Oh, so five minutes scrum wallabies. Hold on to your hats. This Six. could be it. 55 gone. Big chance for the wallabies to put this one away. Can Eddie's boys do the unthinkable? Gordon. Drops it in short. Oh, there's numbers out to the right. Oh, they've stuffed it up. He's absolutely butchered it. It was a three on nothing overlap on the right hand side. And somehow it's not come off the try. They could eventually get it though, the Wallabies. Grand inside ball. And they will score the second try of the night. And they take the lead back. 12 7. Kick to come. All to play for. Rory Arnold with the try. Well, how they didn't score here. Karevi just stuffed that up. Something spectacular. Flicked around the corner. Great offloading game. Not letting the ball die. Isn't Richie Arnold the one that's in the Wallaby squad? Not Rory? Don't know. Who named their kids Rory and Richie? That's crazy. Crazy. Right. Hodge with a chance to make it a seven point lead. Oh, he sprayed it. He sprayed it. It's gone wide. Door is ajar for Finn Russell and the Scottish. Five point difference only. This is why you play on the, the slightly lower difficulties because they miss hard kicks. The actual, this World Cup or the actual World Cup, Lord Melbourne, because, ooh, tell you what, this one's close. 
I don't think it'll be Scotland and Australia though. Here is Bell. I still think France is going to be right there at, at the actual World Cup. Still, I'm still thinking the France New Zealand final. But we'll see. We will see. Wallabies got the ball now though, and they are looking. The yeah, Ireland have got a chance. South Africa, I think, are going to play some fun games, and they'll they'll be a chance as well. Um, Advantage. Oh, there's a knock on. Wallabies are going to. Wallabies are going to annoy a few teams, but here we go. We've got a chance for Scotland to attack. <clears throat> they'll make the playoffs still. Scotland numbers on the left side. Here we go. Over. It's two on one. Can they finish? Oh, they do. Brilliant pass. Scotland in the corner. It's 12-12. Kick to come. I don't think he's going to make the kick, though. Darcy Graham on the left side. What happened to Vandermeerva? Whatever. It's Graham. Graham's playing on the left wing. What's going to win the World Cup? <laughs> Scotland's going to win the World Cup. Come on. What a little drop-off ball there. Brilliant play. Hugh Jones, I expect, will be there in the 13 jumper. With two blood to a 12. But this is a kick to take the lead of the Rugby World Cup final. This is it. Scotland. Left foot of Finn Russell. Oh, he's bulldozed it wide. 12-12. Score remains. We might be going extra time. Fiji are going to win the World Cup, by the way. Go put that tip on. Go put a dollar on it. DG to make the playoffs even. Right, 12-12. Both sides missing a shot at goal. This is the World Cup final we dreamed of. That was close. <laughs> Should have used his right foot. Um, it's been so easy for them to get to the final though, Jack. That's why they just don't care. Chilly. Scotland have got a chance here. They're not going to kick this one out. They're going to run it at the risk of losing possession. A little pick and go. Oh, they've lost possession, just like we said. Instantly, they pay the price. They need a turnover, Scotland. They need something going away. Five minutes till 80 is up. Big run. That could be a turn. Oh, that was close to a turnover. McDermott offloads. One more. The one going to Aussie. Of course, it's him. The ball back inside. And the Wallabies will do the unthinkable. And through Pete Samu, who's not even in their World Cup team at the start, they have scored what should be, could be, maybe, the winning try. Maybe Scotland should have kicked it. But it's all Nwangani to us. Yeah, big boo. I agree. I want a Scotland to win. But the Wallabies have got finals. Like this is ever going to happen. What's the chances of it being Wallaby Scotland final? Go put that on at the bloody betting agency. Hodge is going to miss this, and it will leave a chance for Scotland to... Oh, Hodge. No, piss off, mate. Oh, you dickhead. Okay. The converted try required by Scotland. They've still got time. They've still got time. They can put it right down the middle. Regain position. Two minutes, 20 seconds to play. Russell, off the left. Goes short. Well, the Wallabies are offloading here. They're playing like a well oiled machine almost. Carter Gordon didn't give the ball to Angus Bell. I don't know why. This could be a turnover though. Slow to the ball, slow to the breakdown. Hell, you've got to get a turnover there, Scotland. This could be it now. It's gone back to Gordon. Oh, he's kicked it straight down the park. Big chance now for Scotland to attack. And they will. Don't go and touch Scotland. You've got to know your whereabouts. You've got to stay in the field of play. Big chance now to put this one back on their terms. 60 metres they've got to go. A long way. And they're more like 10. Okay, 50 metres to go. And they've sucked in half the Wallabies defenders. Off the back. Oh, and out wide they go. Darcy Graham. One man to beat. He can't get away. No one can hit to Aussie. Go left. Quick. Advantage. Oh, he's knocked it on. Would have been easier to Advantage hang on to over. it. Advantage is over. This will bounce at the touch of the Wallabies. Are you World Cup victors? For a hypothetical, it won't happen in real life. 2023 Rugby World Cup. What a final. What a crazy, 
crazy final that was. What a crazy World Cup. We were coming on to play Be A Pro and look where we've ended up. The Wallabies. Unthinkable that they got this far. Big boos in the crowd. Three tries to two. Graham and two, Pilotu. Two. They just weren't good enough for the breakdown Scotland and that's what hurt them. Arnold, Samu and McDermott picking up one apiece. Hodge, two out of three. Russell, one out of two. Crazy is one word for it, Finn. You're not wrong. 19-12. All those form teams you thought about at the start of the World Cup didn't make it. Well, Scotland were form, actually. Eddie paid the ref. Well, uh, yeah. He's got his little good luck charm cat up there going like this. You see, that's why they won. That's why they won. Close game, though. Intriguing game. 19-12, the final score. I hope we don't see this in two months' time. Arnold's the captain. Scotland had a try robbed. You're right. They did. Who was that ref that, um... <laughs> he puts that respectability on... The respect on Australia's name. Who was that ref that uh, ran away when he when he uh, robbed Scotland of that last... Well, that was last World Cup, wasn't it? Um, it was a... Was it a South African ref? I've forgotten his name. Jabir? I think it was. And he ran. Ran off the park. That was Scotland, Australia. We've had a repeat. History. They say it doesn't repeat. Well, it has. It absolutely has. Wow. <laughs> I just got three achievements for that. 2015? I think it was, wasn't it? Yeah, last World Cup. What happened? It should have been a Scottish penalty, wasn't it? A guy offside. Eddie Jones was right. North Melbourne. I can't remember what happened, but I remember him making that call and running from the park that, that knocked Scotland out of the tournament. Was it, a, was it a quarterfinal? I can't even remember. Well, at least we say this, the better. Well played, Australia. Well played. You've done a good job. Good on you. Australia got the penalty to win? Was it the other way around? I thought it was Scotland didn't get a penalty. But you might be right, Finn. You probably are right. I just remember running from the field and I was just like, what the hell? And of course, the... Uh, the build up to that as well, which is just, that was crazy, crazy World Cup. This World Cup here was just insane. Don't care about stats. Top 10. Hang on. What if, what if we go like top 10 try scorers at the World Cup? It'll be all forwards. Oh no, Anton Leonard Brown. Marnie Lubbock. Gareth Thomas. Carter Gordon. Jack Knilson for Japan. Lucio Sinti from Argentina. Darcy Graham got four. A Georgian in there as well. Now, Max Wilson now. You're right, North Melbourne. We're going to crack on with some beer pro. Marvin Ori got three tries for South Africa, as did Willemse. Well, there you go. That was fun. Random. Random, but fun. Mapimpi. Mapimpi didn't even make the list. No, we don't want to save that. That's garbage. But let's play some beer pro. Not that one. This one. We're in preseason. Okay. So back to what we were originally going to start at. We're only an hour, 20 minutes late. That's all right. Back to Max. I did see the Springboks team, North Melbourne. They've gone pretty much all out, which is surprising. Manny Libok, who just got one of the most tries in the tournament, um, is playing, which surprises me, considering if they lose him, they are in a world of trouble. But, um, yeah, it's an interesting team. I haven't seen the Wales team, though, yet. So, that'll be interesting. I do think the Springboks are going to beat them quite easily. After, especially what we saw last week. So, we'll see how that goes. We are... Doo -doo 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 -doo. What are we doing here? South and Stewart around for the Shield. And we have a game against them at the end of the season. Which they would have lost it by then. We do have one, two, three, four crappy preseason games. But I, f I feel like we need the good ratings. We could skip them. But have they made any changes? <laughs> what is the shield? The shield's the Ranfordy shield. So it's uh, the Ranfordy shield is 
a tournament, oh, not a tournament, it's it's, it's, a, it's a, a shield, literally a shield. And the holder defends it when they play at home against anyone during the regular season. So, for example, it's a tournament, it's a, it's a competition within a competition. Okay, so Southland hold it right now, okay, in this, in this competition. I think Wellington have got it in real life. Uh, and when we look at fixtures, see they're playing Wellington here. Away, they won't defend it because they're away. They're playing Tasman away. They won't defend it there either. See you later, Neon. Thanks for coming by, man. Good to see you. I hope to see you again next time as well. Thanks for the company, dude. And then, there we go. So here we go. August the 27th, Southland versus Otago. Shield is on the line. They will hold it till then because they are not playing at home until then. And so, if Otago win, they take the shield. It doesn't affect the NPC in any way of points or anything like that. It's just you beat that holder at home, you take the trophy, and then Otago will hold it. And then they all host Mano or two the next round. The shield will be on the line. Should they win? If they lose, Southland will defend it against counties in the next round. If that makes any sense. It's a cool little extra. Um, Southland hasn't won it since, I think, 20, 2001, 2002. A long, long time ago. So... Yeah, the fact that they've won it on here and kept it for near a season is crazy. We are almost a play kicker for this team. That's crazy too. What do we got to do? Make three tackles, screw a try. Less than one handing error, drop goals. God damn it. And 15 running meters. Right, so we can we can smoke four of those. We've got to screw a try though. Uh, but we are pretty good. We are a pretty good player. Right, let's get ourselves some, um, some beer pro time. <clears throat> we'll see... See how far we get. I mean, we've got four preseason games, but I think we need the uh, practice. Not the, well, not personally, but Max needs the, Max needs the ratings. Let's see what he can do. We're going to be greedy. We're going to be a greedy prick. Uh, we're not going to let anyone else have the ball. It's going to be all about us. We're going to take sniping runs. We're going to stand at 10. Uh, we're going to be like a, who was that? Was that Piranara who, who was a, a cover number 10 at the 2011 World Cup? I think he was. No, 2015. 2015 he was the cover, wasn't he? For a, for a number 10. Any big changes here for counties? Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Who are we up against? Danelia. Whatever, mate. The Barrett's are all on the bench. Let's go. Let's get ourselves some... Um, <clears throat> some match ratings. Because we're under pressure here as well. To actually perform so running meters gets points kicking meters gets points oh we're off to a great start here like a background here oh one more and we were in no 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 don't get in the race no no no, no. Oh, god damn it keep pushing roll but here we go a big chance on the inside 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 pass offload quick ball quick ball you're offside, mate. Yes, we've got to try. Nice and early. Brilliant. Little snipe off the back. Oh, we'll take running meters. We'll take a try. We'll take everything. Thanks for coming. We're off to a great start. Max Wilson's in. Naki lead. This is a great run. This is Joe. Geordie's in the starting team. See, it's all about Geordie. Little snipe. There we go. Easy try. Got the pace to burn. Good start. Now we're going to make some tackles, I think. Tackles get us points. Kicking meters get us points. Oh, Jordy's sound the kicks. Okay, Jordy, you, you deal with this, Jordy. Thanks, Jordy. 7 0. Imagine if we can get Bowden and Scott in the team as well. It would be incredible. And Lord and Vay. We've got a stacked team. Deep kick here. Oh, I don't want it. If I get injured, because you're incompetent at taking a kickoff, I will be annoyed. Get round the corner, mate. Oh, just about a wee snap through. We are North Melbourne. That's the plan. Our Retro Rugby Wednesday is a thing now. So I think we're, we're teaming up again. Oh, big high shot. Teaming up with the man, Jack, up the top there, who's going to uh, <laughs> jam some Rugby 15 online. Uh, on Wednesday, so that'll be interesting. Uh, but we've also we've got a few old games. Uh, we'll be getting Rugby 08 going as well. We're just sitting here sooner or later, and 
yeah, just, just old old rugby stuff. Rugby Challenge 1 was cool. I, I'd jam that all day. Still the probably the best, almost. <laughs> rugby 15 was not a great game. You're 100% correct there, North Melbourne. Right, Max. Have a little run here, Max. Oh, big gap, Max. A little grubber kicker behind, Max. Oh, just about regathered. It got us some kicking meters. Rugby 15 will be fun because it's so bad, Jack. That's the problem. <laughs> okay. Advantage. Oh, no. What a crappy hospital pass that was. We need to make some tackles here, boys, actually. No, I got him. Here we go. Release. Man, Rugby Challenge 1 is cool. I mean, if you still play Rugby Challenge 1, then after that Advantage session over. we had on Wednesday. Oh, what a step. Counties are in. Uh, after playing that on Wednesday, I'd say, it's, yeah, why not? It's a great game. It's a really fun game. Nathaniel Upper. I would play Rugby Challenge 1 as well. All the time. 2011 Rugby World Cup. Well, we've got 2015 Rugby World Cup on here. We're going to jam, uh, I don't know, this Wednesday, next Wednesday. Who knows? Who knows? We've got enough games. We could crack out a tournament. Get those mods actually working. Actually, we've got mods on Rugby Challenge 1. We could play a little tournament. Oh, we could do the World Cup there with old school teams and see who wins. That'll be fun. It's all about the World Cup. Right, Geordie. We're not leading anymore, and I've still got to make tackles. There we go. You guys both fell off tackles. I'll keep a turn over here. Just about got a turn. I still need to make a uh, another tackle. Tackles get you... Tackles get your points, so we want to make those. Hitting rucks doesn't get you points. I've got him, lads. Yeah, thanks for coming. They won't work online, but they'll work... Oh. Crap, we're away. Uh, they'll work in just an AI tournament. We're going to turn this over here, boys. Good work, good work. Little step, a little shimmy, a little tackle. Yeah, I don't know what happened with Rugby Challenge 2. I tried it again after the stream as well, North Melbourne, and it, it, didn't, it just didn't want to work. It just comes off an error. So I'll try... I'll try... Um, I'll try troubleshoot that. Go, Geordie. I hate how your player just like freezes when you when you pass out like that. Like, why? Why can't I move? Let me get across. Why? A dive pass, literally one meter. Right, here we go. A little short side play, lads. Come on. Up. Oh, good catch. Give to Geordie. I'll float. Good. Now. Uh, run! Run, Max! Get up there! Well, I want to float this one miles out. Okay, not quite what I had in mind, but it's all right. No, 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 don't join that. No, Release. no, get out. Okay, Jordy, you're the scrum half now. Advantage. Just knocked it on. Going to play the ID ITM Cup tomorrow. Hey, th this tournament, I know it's like, a busy week for rugby but uh if you are crouch find short of rugby to watch i was trying to think of a good word there Set. this tournament that we're playing right now i think it's called the it's just, it's just the npc again now natural provincial competition um oh look at max go one more one more oh couldn't beat him is on now it started about two two or three weeks ago and it is don't go out oh you clown it is on now, so if you're, if you're after a bit more rugby to watch in the uh, New Zealand slash Southern Hemisphere time zone, there you go, Bunnings NPC Cup. Oh. Jeez. Screw off, Bunnings. It's NPC. We've had, like, how many different names in the last 10 years? In New Zealand Cup, uh, Moda 10 Cup, ITM Cup. It's just the NPC. Is he going to kick this out? Oh, yes, good work. Well, thanks for coming. 7-7. Seven, seven. What now are we playing, actually? I, I, I wish this game, like, hit, like 2K games, had a wee rating up the top. Where you could be like, oh, I'm playing a, a, a you know, B plus or whatever. 
Uh, I'll drop goals. I can't believe we only had one handing error to make. So dumb. Kicking meters as well. You watch every NPC game? Well played. Even I struggle to watch every... Oh, I don't watch every game. Release. I uh, try to check out most of the internationals though from the weekend. I think they're worth watching at the moment. But it depends, depends what teams they pick up at the moment, to be honest with you. Who goes full street? Who decides to rest and rotate? That'll be the interesting part, especially this weekend. And next weekend. Ooh. Ooh, you dicey little scummer. Did we fall off that tackle? Get up. Get, get up. Get up. Get across. Shut this down. Shut this down. Oh, yes. Good, good, good. Can't move. Here we go. There's a bit of space here. Oh, triple cutout pass to the wing. And he didn't run. Up we go, lads. In the hole, oh, power game. Nice. Oh, I thought that pass was mine. That pass is mine, though. Run into the corner, Max. Yes. We take the lead. Our second try. 12 7. Who do I support the NPC? Uh, you support Northland? I'm from Southland, so I support the local boys. How did this, how did this get to Max's hands? That was a really good pass. Acceleration. That's what he's all about. That's what Maxi Boy does. See, your team, North Melbourne, and my team had an epic of garbage match last weekend. Oh, that's right. Geordie's kicking. I'm used to kicking. Oh, well done, Geordie. You've actually got that over. Well played, Geordie. Yeah. Two tries. Both to Max. We're taking over preseason. They're my local team, North Melbourne, so yeah. I don't have any huge connection to any other side. The stags are always good to laugh at. Let's go, boys. Come on. Third try and coming. I'll go inside. Oh, great pass to Geordie. Couldn't tee up there. Someone else grab it. I can't be the passer and the securer at the same time. Great ball. Exceptional pass. Step inside. Oh, the fullback's too good. He's just, he's, he's shut me down like three times. <laughs> the cover players on attack on this game are useless. One more game, EA. One more game. Ain't gonna happen, man. Someone who actually has the ability to do a press conference or a press release uh, would be good. That could just be like, hey, we're making a game. This is what it looks like. Hey, the game's coming out soon. Here's a trailer. Anything would be great. Bears Gaming. Buddy, how are you going from England? What's the time in England? Must be pretty late, right? I hope you're doing well, my friend. I hope you're doing well. There's a man that should play some online. We should get you involved in that, Bears. We play some online games. Some online matchups. They're laggy. They're garbage, but they're funny. And that's what matters. I don't think Peter Fitter missed a kick on the last stream either. I think, I think Peter Fitter was the man. But Jordy's come in and he's taken over. Southland is the stacks. You are 100% right. England's one hour behind South Africa. That doesn't help me know what time it is. <laughs> Here we go. Here's a try. Offload. Oh, no. I need offload, Max. You've got to offload those plays, my friend. Midnight! God! It's 11 a.m. here. Why am I still doing the lineouts? Good take. Run it, Max! Get across! They're cutting back like nothing else. Turn over, turn over, turn over, boys! Come on! Nope. This 21 7. I think we're pretty safe. Not that this game actually matters. Oh no, we've missed the tackle. Because this is only preseason, so. No matter. No matter whatsoever. It's taking a long time. We're at 62 minutes in. Let's play some... Actually, I need some kicking meters. That's what I really need. Oh, 
Oh, straight out. Naholo. Rugby World Cup predictions, Blake. For a winner? I, I still, I'm still going with New Zealand France final. In all seriousness, I'm still going with it. I'm not changing it. Oh, almost a steal. I don't know why. I just, I just, I just want France to do well. As much as it pains me that they're actually, you know, that's the fact. I, I still want them to do well. I think it's their time to do well again. Make it another final. Ooh, good tackle, good take. Don't let him away. Don't let him go. I don't know why you have to do the line outs as a scrum half, even North Melbourne. It's a bit dumb. A lock or a hooker or any forward, Please. sure. But as a scrum half, you should just stand there. Who do you reckon is going to win the um, World Cup, Blake? Yeah, I know. Yeah, they've lost into Mac, which is, which is for the whole tournament, honestly. Like, why wouldn't you want to watch a player like him and his combinations uh, with, with Ramos and his combinations with DuPont? That's, I was excited to see that. I don't, I don't think they'll be the same. Like, I was, I was hard thinking that they would be a finalist. Whereas now, I'm like, I don't know. But then you go, well, is South Africa going to be the team that makes the final? But then you're like, South Africa don't have a 10 either. At least, you know, if, if um, Delavere or someone goes in there. <sighs> yeah, then there's Ireland as well. But I'm, Ireland haven't picked a team. And we don't know the full situation of the of the Sexton situation. England's... Screw England. I don't think anyone wants England to win this World Cup anymore. Um, sorry. So, sorry, Bears game. <laughs> sorry, Bears. <laughs> uh, but yeah, Ireland are in the mix. If you... Release. <laughs> anyone not from England won't want England to win this World Cup. England have made themselves, man, that's a crazy good try. England have made themselves public enemy number one, I reckon, in this week. Everyone's like, screw England. You're going out in the pool stage. Ireland will be there. Um, yeah, I, I don't, I think England will still make it out of the pool. I'd love to see Argentina and Japan do some damage, but yeah. I don't know, it might wear off before the World Cup. It depends what happens now that World Rugby has actually said, nah, we're appealing the, the decision on, on Farrell. If, if it comes out and they're like, nah, you got, you, you're going to get four weeks, mate. And he misses the first two games, maybe the hate will go off a bit. But uh, at the moment, you know if they play a Pacific Island team, which they play, do they play Samoa? I think it's Samoa. Whatever team it is, they are going to be out for blood. They will be out for blood. Lua Tua has come out. He hates them. Fikitoa has come out. He hates them. Oh, I hate. They're pissed off at the Not decision. Policing. Oh, penalty. Oh, we got a penalty. Oh, we can win this game. No, it's preseason though. Uh, which team are you going to play later in the ITM Cup? Uh, use. Bay of Plenty. Farrell is the next chairman of World Rugby. Oh, look at this! Look at this from Jordy! Oh, Jordy, yes! Good work, my lad. Good work. Excellent stuff. Yeah, it is Samoa, North Melbourne. You're right, yeah. Samoa in England. Depends what, what, what happens. If Samoa in England and, and it's status quo, then um, that is going to be a fiery matchup. Oh, we've got a chance here. We've got support. We've got support. Oh, what are you doing, you clown? <laughs> the AI in this is so dumb. You got an open line. And what does he do? He's like, oh, pass it and kick it out. What a dick. What a dick. I just wish they could get a rugby game where all international and the top leagues are licensed. 100% agree with you, Blake. 150% agree with you. All right, Jacko. Thanks for coming by, my friend. We will see you. Oh, we'll see you uh, maybe tomorrow morning. Same time tomorrow as in my Saturday. But definitely Monday. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. That's our jam. Um, I'm going to be making a little video, a little bit of schedule we'll put up on the uh, on the pages as well for you guys. Or anyone who doesn't see it. What's up, Cullum? How you doing, my man? 
So, um, yeah. We're on for uh, Rugby 15 Day. We actually won that game, which is surprising. And it took way longer than I was expecting. But did we get a... Did we get a good rating? That is the thing. We're after ratings. We did fail this one. Oh, we didn't even try a drop goal. I forgot about it. Uh, nice increases, though. Look at that speed and acceleration. Oh, Callum, I saw that. I seen you message me. <laughs> and I tried to reply. And it's like, this account doesn't exist. It's like, what the hell? What is going on? Um, what happened? I've been, been abused. You, you've pissed off Elon. That's what's happened. He's put the crackdown on you. That's that's the problem. Yeah, you piss off Elon. He's going to run you over for Tesla. That's that's what goes wrong. The woman doing an NPC Cup. Farrah pa Farrah, Farrah Palmer Cup. Don't know why that was so hard to say. Um, doesn't run as long. But it's still pretty good. Still pretty good. We did well here. I mean, as a scrum half, losing passing is, is not good. He <laughs> didn't do anything. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Those are troublesome things. Uh, join the Discord, Cullum, if you want. Uh, you can drop us a message there. That's probably the safest way outside of Twitter. Uh, yeah, we are 70 rated. You're right. It'd be good if we can get a bit higher. Oh, what do we rate? I didn't even... Oh, oh it's a friendly. You don't get ratings. What? Okay, we're skipping friendlies in that case then. Oh, piss off. That's shit. Why don't you get ratings and friendlies? Okay, screw friendlies. We're skipping them. Oh, look at that. Alerts worked. Woohoo. Cheers, Blake. I'm pretty sure that's for subscribing on YouTube, right? Good man. Just join the Discord. Sweet ass. Drop us a message in there uh, whenever and I'll get back to you. Busy day today. Wow. What? Women's Curry Cup. The Bulls women team beat uh, 103 0. Against the Sharks woman, really? Ouch. Ouch. That's, that's ouch. That's a real ouchie. Big, big ouchie. Well, oh, sweet. I'm glad the alerts work. There you go. They're all different. Got to love a bit of bullfire Justin Marshall in there as well. So if you do anything else special, um, there's all sorts of cool ones going. I, I have not, Cullum. I have not made... I've not made new overlays for the World Cup games, um, but it won't be anything too special. Uh, but hopefully something a bit more, a bit nicer, a bit nicer. The Bulls woman won 103, 102-10 against the Lions woman. Wow, the Bulls woman are clearly, clearly the best teams. Well, you should let me see what you got. We can um, work something out together. So I don't know what I'm really going to do. Blake, yeah, 100% we're playing Rugby 24 when it comes out. I wish I could give you some news on Rugby 24 still, but after about three weeks of trying to contact them, messaging them, emailing a, a weird address that got no reply, unsurprisingly, uh, I still have no news for you. Although we've not checked the page, actually. What is today? Friday. I've not checked the page since... Did we look on Monday? Maybe we'll have a look. Let's. I'm, I'm not playing friendlies anymore anyway, by the way, team. Because you don't get... Taranaki one. You don't get ratings, which ratings are our problem. Was that a friendly? Yeah, it was a friendly. Piss off North Harbour. Go away, Auckland. All right, let's get into the real season. We got mail. Oh, no. There goes our team. Barrett's are gone. Tahorirangi's gone. This is what we need to rectify. How many games we got this season? Three, seven, ten. All right. All right, we've got ten games. Southland lost to Wellington, but again, it was away. So that's all we need to worry about. Right, let's get into the real business. Game time. It's called the uh, Women's Premier Division. I'll have to have a look at it. It sounds like a one-sided affair. The question is, though, how did the Sharks women go against the Lions women? That's the question. They both got pumped, but how do they go against each other? That's the big one. Should we see, before, hang on, before we go too far, let's go back to the, uh, let's go back to the World Cup here. Not that you guys can see this, but, um, let's see if there's anything on Rugby 24, shall we? That 
Ali and P, do you think I can make it to pro rugby if I start to play now? I'm 24, 25 next year, and I I moved from Niger in 2020. Niger, did you say it properly? And fell in love with the game through you and Scottish Cannon. Oh, you're a champion. You're a champion, sir. Um, dude, you can do anything you want, man. You can do anything you possibly want. To make it pro doesn't mean you're winning a World Cup final. To make it pro, you're just in a club. There's so many pro clubs. You moved... Where did you move to? I'll check it out, Cullum. I see our Discord's popped up with a, a thing there, so I will check that out. Did you move to England, or where have you gone? Because that's the biggest question. Rugby24 has still... has still done nothing. <laughs> Someone's paying them out in the comments. You're not even advertising the game on your own website. Uh, it's a bit sad. It's really a bit sad. What else is there? Rugby24 on Twitter? Or X? Whatever the hell you want to call it. Nothing. Nothing at all. So no, no news. No news on... Um, No news on Rugby 24. You're in South Auckland. I know a lot of people. Do you play club rugby? Because through the videos and stuff that I do with, if you guys know Driving More and stuff like that, uh, guys like Stephen Harris uh, and, and Bowler and stuff have a lot to do Northland, Auckland, and Northland Club Rugby. So, if you're if you're playing club rugby, um, they will know you. Or if you're not, or you're working towards it, then you can. Yeah, they will probably people to talk to. Why did that go so bloody bright? Wow. Loading screen just like freaks out. Um, yeah. Let us know what you're, what you're actually playing in. Pro, I mean, pro is only this level, like, NPC level. It's not... Dude, it's not impossible. It's, it's Auckland, it probably is, because Auckland rugby has got some major issues right now. Major, major issues. Uh, but if you could get exposed and sign for Taranaki, Wellington, anyone at all... Uh, you could definitely, definitely make it. I don't know why that's just freaked out there. YouTube just had a, a little, a little frenzy. That's all right. Um, yeah, you should, uh, much easier, far easier to make it pro in all the hemisphere countries. In my province of Ulster, if you play for Ireland at under 18 or 19 level, you will get a contract. Wow. Just, just go, go play, LMP. Go play. Go play. Um, I'll talk to those guys I know and see, because they are based in Auckland. And um, hey, you can only but learn. You can only. Hey, look at look at that German guy. Uh, German. Oh shit! I've forgotten his name. Ah, oh, come on. Anyone else watch Super Rugby? He, he played. Played for the Blues. Played for Auckland. He's from Germany. He came to New Zealand to learn how to play rugby. And he just went straight through. Oh, what was his name? It's a flanker. This is going to annoy the shit out of me. i got to find out. Wait. What was his name? Anton Signer. Ha, beat yous. Uh, so... Anton Signer's from Germany. He moved over here to play rugby in New Zealand because, you know, everyone's got this, whatever you call it, that New Zealand rugby is the place to be. Which, okay, yeah, it is. But, um, like, yeah, like Blake says, it's not the easiest place to make it, um, especially going through Auckland. But it's probably some of those other unions. Auckland's not the greatest at picking its own players. 
Um, it's a very much an old man's club in terms of getting through there. But still, it's a you got to get through. you got to play. you just got to join a team, dude. Join a team. Get involved. Um, and see how far you can go. Get to the NPC. That's pro level. That is pro level. And you're not... 24 is not old. Um, how, how old was Anton Signer, actually? Just to give it... Just to give it a bit of... Um, comparison. So he's 22. He'll be 23 next year. Oh, he played... He went through Tasman. I thought he went through Auckland. He actually went through Tasman. So there you go. He played club rugby. <clears throat> oh, he went through Nelson College. Well, there you go. He got a scholarship through Nelson College. And played for Tasman and then got picked up by the Blues. I thought he played in Auckland, but there you go. So, yeah. He started when he was... For the Tasman side at 19. And... Went through the Mighty Ten Cup at that stage, which is this competition here. So, yeah, what? Three, two, three, well, two years. Uh, well, no, at 19, he was pro straight away. So, yeah. Oh, jeez. The camera, the camera likes doing that. Look at that. Oh, that was a nose shot. Nose shot. Let's fix it. There we go. That's where it should be. It's on a bit of a wonky now. There we go. Ah, oh, there you go. Good spotting, Cullum. I didn't even see that. I was reading about Anton Segner. The camera sits on a little display up here. And it, and it like, it catches the, um, the zoom button on the lens. Well, there you go. There you go, LMP. We've gone way off track there. Way off track. The Bulls woman has got 702 points in the competition so far and only 51 points against them in 12 matches. Bloody hell. That's crazy. We've got super off track today. Far out. We are all over the show. All over the show. Yellow card nice and early. Off you go, mate. Join the team, Alan Peak. That's all we can say. Cullum's right. Anything you put your mind to, you can achieve. If um, Signa could do it in a year, anyone can do it in a year. Right, let's get some wins here, boys. Let's get some. Let's get some W's going. Let's get some match ratings, actually. <laughs> smash at the back of the lineup. Nice to see a, a lock just absolutely smashing you in the corner. Oh, what, a, what happened there? What's a finish? I didn't even know who's on the right wing because, oh, Mataheli's back. Mataheli's back. No worries, dude. Just just give it a crack. Give it a crack. Are you on the Discord server, LMP? Or or on Twitter, X, whatever? Um, any of those? Because I'm kind of curious as to what would be you know, if those people I know that they live and work and rugby up in Auckland, uh, what they think. And I want to kind of let you know as to what they think would be best. Mm. What's your favourite game mode in Rugby Challenge 4? Um, probably be a pro, probably. I just like the... I like, I like not being able to affect everything. Well, that's frustrating and I yell at the game. It's just fun not being able to just control everything about the game. Oh, here we go. Maxi boy. Oh, there's a try on here. Oh, brilliant. Got it away. There we go. Naholo's in. Try time for the Naki. I've trained Ospreys at nine years old and played for three teams at once. I played back in the... Um, the younger days. Not so much recently, that's for sure. But yeah, I played through school, uh, through school teams. Mainly. There's a lot of paths you can go. There's a lot of paths through you can go. 
Recently traveled to Cardiff from Ireland under 18 to play against Wales under 18s. Wow. Nice. So watch out for that name in the future. Blake McLean, he's gonna be um, he's gonna be in the Ireland team in a couple of years. Watch out. He's gonna be the guy. I'm reading chat, not actually <laughs> actually playing the game at all. Just because your chat is actually interesting in what you guys are up to. And Max he was just running around in circles like a clown. No, that's Advantage. what he does anyway. Oh, he's knocked it on. What a dick. What a clown. Right wing and inside center. Nice. Got some speedy boys in there. Oh, that's a good little step. Over. Shit, we've got to make three tackles, lads. And we've turned the ball over. Good work. Big smoker downfield. Chase is on. Shouldn't sprint so much, actually. I lose the ball a lot. There you go. Blake's going to be the man. Why am I playing like a fullback? I don't know. I'm trying to keep out of the road. Get it, boys. Get it, boys. Get it, boys. Get it, boys. Go, 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 go. Yes, got it. Back this way, mate. Where oh, don't go that way. Okay, that's not a bad shout. Pass. Mateli, go. Go one more. Inside ball. I'm here. I'm on the shoulder. Oh, short side. Short side. There's a lot of space here. Good ball. Good chance. Here we go, lads. Too early. Played too early. No, no, not the knee operation. Oh, no, they got the player back from the bin. All right, let's seal their line out. I'm glad I don't have to do line outs in the... Um, as a pro. Jesus, where's he gone? A snippy little run there. Another big turnover. Get in there, boys. Let's retain this, lads. Come on. Good work, good work, good work, good work. You know where we're going here? We're going to go to the skies. Big bomb. I want some kicking meters. Chase that, chase that. Oh, he got it back. Yes. Excellent. Release. Got it back. That's amazing. Drop short. Release. Slip it around the corner. Go out wide, out wide, out wide, out wide. Go one more. Look, there's so many numbers. Oh, he's been smashed in the corner. Can we drop this down in the corner? No, we'll go this way. Get it, get it, get it. No, oh, just short. Pick and go, boys. Come on. Use the forwards. Mazzelli's up on the ball. Oh, they turned it over. We're going to get this back, lads. Here we go. We got it back. Oh, missed ball. How are we not scoring this? He had to give that. Another big gap. Numbers game, Mateli. Oh, manipulating well. Into the corner, we're gonna score this time. No. Jeez, how are we not scoring? Carry it over, get it. Yes, Max has got the try. No, what? We were celebrating the try and we lost it. How do we not score that? How do we not score? Round the corner, boys. Round this way. Back to the left. Back to the left. It's half time. Right. Let's go to the left. right side this time. Early pass. Why no eat? Gotcha. Oh, went too early. Oh, we're going to get this try. Yes. We are going to get the try. That was, that was extremely on edge. Extremely on edge. You have no social media? You don't even have Discord? Discord's not really a social media. Jump on Discord. It's like a, a server where you can talk. I think you should jump on there. You don't actually... Can you, I, don't, I, don't, I think you need to actually download a, an actual item, but... It's just like, uh, 
old school Skype. Is it? Nah, it's better than that. Yeah, jump on the odd store. A chat wise would be alright. Or here. Uh, you'll give it a good go because you really started training. Like going for a run of ball skills. Yeah, give it a crack, man. Go go to practices. Go to trials. Uh, club rugby starts soon, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, get involved in a club. Get involved in a club. No, next stream, Blake. Do, 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 do. Mm, tomorrow morning slash... So as in this time tomorrow, I'm going to try to do one, which is a 50-50. It's a um, but... Definitely Monday. Jesus, I can't think today. Uh, we're up 21 now. Definitely Monday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. That's the three days. So I'm going to put something in the community tab for everyone to look at. We'll be here. We're on YouTube. We're on Twitch. Uh, we'll be on videos, which I have to record today. So that's what I'm doing after this. And yeah, doing streams. Thanks for coming by, Blake. Good to see you. Thanks for the chat, man. It's good to see some budding players up there. Kicking it. Keep it up, dude. We'll see you Monday or all tomorrow. You should get a notification. If I tell you anything, Twitch is probably better at notifications than YouTubers, which are predominantly... They are terrible at notifications. Right, let's win this line out. Get some ball out to the backs. Or kick it. That's not what I intended, but it works. Has completed my kicking meters, so I'll take that. Tackle as well. And a ruck turnover. Advantage. Oh, maybe, just maybe. Oh, how about that? What? Oh, yes, good. Offside. I like it. Good work. The Targo's going down. And look, if they win the round for the shield next two rounds time, we don't get a shot at it. Oh, hello, boom for ha. Cullum. Thanks for, thanks for the uh, follow, dude. It was good. We're, e we're eking closer on Twitch, that one. Uh, we're eking closer to the 30. Not that it really means much, but it's all good. We need to increase the volumes of the bumpfars, I think. We've got to have some Justin Marshall bumpfar. There was a new Cullum. It was another... Hang on. It was Cullum... Cullum... Ilgrip, 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 I L E G. Well, you saw it on the screen. Why am I spelling it? <laughs> uh, that's the difference between. You see, we got Twitch gone, we got YouTube gone, we got it all gone on. Different columns and different streams. Magical. That was. <laughs> oh, that was you. I read. I read your comment wrong. How do you say, how do you say, is that your last name? Il, how do you say it properly? Oh, we've lost the ball. How did I read that was me as that wasn't me? Oh, we've got a turn over there, boys. Good play, good play. I-L-E. Oh, a tiger, I got the ball. Is that how you pronounce it? Isle? Oh no, they're going to score. Ay, ay, ay. It's all going off here. Jonah Nareki's coming back. We're trying to spell. Oh, okay, that's all it is. I L E it. Isle it. Isle it. Oh, okay. Nice. Nice. Nice, nice. Thanks for following us on there anyway, buddy. It's got us up. Oh, we're almost 24. We're, all, we're cranking towards that 30. And then it's only up from there. I don't know if I actually prefer streaming on, on Twitch or on YouTube. YouTube's probably quite better. A lot of you guys come on more on YouTube than Twitch, but... Well, the same platform in the end, isn't it? It'd be cool if we could unify the chats. That Now, that would be cool. Is that Josh Uani? Jesus, what a fall from grace he has. Grandpa was a scrum half and uncle was a flanker. I hope he's a flanker. Nice, dude. Rugby in the family, eh? Oh, look at us go here. Up the necky. Come on. We've got to play well so we get a contract next season. 
We're busting. Come on, inside. Quick, get up. Not Max. Oh, no, he's in touch. Think YouTube's better because we've got more subscribers on YouTube. Yeah, that's the thing. If you stream on YouTube, it does alert everyone who is subscribed. So it alerts a lot more of you guys than... Uh, oh, we've turned that over. Than Twitch would. That's, you're correct about that. Oh, how are we going to lose this? That's bad. You got this fullback, fella? Oh, I don't know how we kept that in. You have four nephews and they all play rugby. That is impressive. That's how it all starts, LMP. If you're still here, just get out and play. Is that not a penalty? Come on. What? I was the only guy in that ruck bashing the jackal button and nothing happened. That's better. Pass, pass, pass. Not happening. Not happening. Otago's going to stage the big comeback here. Second try. Ten minutes to play. Oh, oh we're, getting, we're getting beaten down. Theo Tompkinson. Back from the bin. Back in the tries. Josh Uani. He does play back for Otago, I'm pretty sure, in the NPC anyways. Interestingly enough. It's a cool kit, actually. Big O on it. Right. Let's make sure we win this game. We've only got a 10-point lead, so we need to secure the result. And a pro what about... Actually, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, wow. Nice. We're five from five, so let's just get more points. Let's do that match rating up. Let's get some more tackles. Let's get some more uh, kicking meters, some more running meters. Ruck turnovers, they'll do. Tries even. Oh. Release. Not getting through that, fella. <laughs> get smoked in defense. Get up, Max. Come on. We'll go that way. Big pass out wide. Get this, finish it off. Seal that deal. Thank you for coming. That's the finish. That's all we needed. Deal done. It's how we roll. It's how we roll in the necky. Yo. That was a big hit. But this was more impressive here. Back. Look at this. Fired out pass. Wham. Finish with Matele. We got a win. Opening game of the season. Benefit is back. Woohoo. I've only just noticed. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Stephen. I've only just noticed that you're kicking again. Because Geordie's out of the team. That's why it's going to look. Pinafetta. Wow. What a player. Should have been the goal kicker all the way through. Should have been. Well, we've got a minute and a half to go. Let's finish this. Let's end it. Let's wrap it up. Someone else take it. Hit a ruck. And then. Or just get smoked like that. That's fine. Just another year. Hey. Isn't that a second? Rev. That's two yellows. Why? Get them off. Red. There's no no talking sense with these referees. Tap it and kick it out. Don't don't just kick it. Now we're gonna play a line out, and I'm just gonna kick it straight out anyway. Alright, we're going to Florence to the back, and then I'm just drilling this into touch. Advantage. Uh -oh. <laughs> That's off. Now we've made a handing error. Release. That annoys me. Now we're going to lose that. Turn it over. Release. Don't concede a penalty, actually. That would be that would be really bad. That's full time, though. Because we've turned it over. That'll be it. The penalty goes up. Man, I'm glad we didn't have a handing error on there for that one. Hopefully it doesn't make us lose any points in catching and passing. Good win, though. Starting off the NPC season with a victory. Four tries to two, 31 14. Two to Mateli. We got one. Naholo got one as well. Peter Feta. Perfect off the tee. What a player he is. Uh, Nareki and Topkinson scoring the tries for the big O of Otago. What do we do? Four, 
four handing it. So look at that. Six tackles, five, five contests, one. Wow. One line break, one try. Wow. What a bizarre, what a bizarre stat line that is. Right, five out of five. Full house, yes. 71 rated as well. We look good. Big increases all around the board. Goal kicking's gone up as well as kicking, which is whatever. Uh, but yeah, a little bit on speed. Not much though. A 3.9. Piss off, that's a 3.9. That was an incredible performance. And a 3.9. Ugh, the ratings are stuffed. What a more can we do here? More line breaks, I guess. More tackles. More kicking meters would have done the job. Okay, we've got work to do. Next up, we take on Northland. Do, 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 do. That is an away game. In Australia. Bizarre. Whatever. Australia Cup Stadium. That's weird as. That is super weird. Uh, the team, the same. What's our, what's our standings look like? One from one. When do we... How uh, the uh, shield? There we go. So Tasman beat Southland, but it wasn't a shield game. Next one is a shield game against Otago. All right, let's get to that. What do we got to do? Make three tackles, drop goals, handing errors, kicking meters, and score a try. Okay, we can do that. We can do that. It's easy cheesy to do. One of my nephews is a tight end prop. One is a fullback. One is an upside flanker. And one is a blindside flanker. My goodness. Got the whole team covered there. Come from start to finish, buddy. That's crazy. Everyone's having a go. Love it. Love to see it. Right, what are we up to here? We've got Kane Jacobson. Didn't know there was a Kane. Got Will Grant. Debrasini, Gomez is confused. Don't know why that's like that. Rennie Ranger looks nothing like him. Just put a buff head on him, and that's what he looks like. Lamert, who the hell is Lamert? Our fullback is called Warwick Lamert. Thirty-four, Grandpa. Right, let's move on. Barrett's is still on the bench. Not sure why. Right, let's get a win against Northland. I want to see where the Ramfordy Shield goes. I'll have a look at the Discord after um after the stream. Cut him. Just got a, like a spam of stuff all coming at once. Yeah, I've joined a ruck. That's not great. Make some tackles, lads. Let's get a turnover, boys. Nope, not even there. You're doing create, mate. Franklin, we're doing a create. What? We're doing be a pro. If that's what you mean. Oh, we've been skinned. We've been left like a dummy lying in the dirt. Get out of that. Is it Max close to playing for the USA? Uh, oh, there was no one back and he's kicked it. Oh, what an idiot. It's gone in touch. Oh, just about a great kick that. Just about a crazy kick. Uh, I'll have a look how close he is after the game. And I'll check out Discord soon, dude. Um, I'll probably stream for, I don't know. Find. Another Set. hour, maybe. Ish. Somewhere around there. Do a few more matches. Get through the season. We're gonna rake off some easy meters here. Oh, I got smashed. Uh no, I'll check out your um check out your message, dude. <laughs> wide ball. Don't know why I do a wide pass. Oh no, don't give it to me there! You idiots! That was a garbage pass. What's going on here? What is going on here? <laughs> you want to make a good rugby game? Oh. What the hell just happened there? Don't make crap like that happen. That is so stupid. Oh, I've missed the tackle. Oh, what an intercept. Oh, plucked out from nothing. But we lose it straight back. Now, this Northern team's not too bad. We are struggling a little bit here to, to keep hold of this one. It's done it again. What the hell? I'm going to go back to this guy and just tackle him. 
Um, I'm going to play two or three or four matches. Uh, probably North Melbourne, yeah. Two or three more. Get some, yeah. I normally go for between three, three and a half hours. Or if I get really excited like the other day, we... What the hell is going on with this game? Uh, we do we do a, a crazy four. Yes, we got the turnover. Go, boys, go. Run. Advantage. Oh, what? I think the game's blowing up. Look at this. Look how stupid this is. Why pass it back? And now I get... Oh. Crouch. There goes Fine. our passing and catching. Out the window. Gone. Set. That's a good hit. An amazing hit there. And you know what? Might as well rake off these kicking meters now while I can. That is a good kick. Very good kick. Let's get a few more of those going, shall we? Sean? Good to see you back, son. Rugby Challenge Run music is good? Yeah, it is. It's the best. It's the best when it was like it's a rugby game and not like a try to be hardcore awesome game. Whoa! That was ours! Yeah, we won't be doing incredibly long because I've got about four videos to record today as well. So we'll try and, try and get that done so you've got some... That's a good kick. Out the fort, but good kick. So you got some videos to watch over the weekend. Some World Cup build-up action. That's what we like. That's what we like to see. Right, let's go a try, damn it. It's half an hour and we've done nothing. I could actually get kicking meters off this. Off we go. Yep, cross the field. Let's get some more kicking meters. And if a winger would like to chase that, would be very nice. Winger? Put him in touch, boys. Penalty! Come on! Oh, God's sake! I was like smashing the hell out of that, and it's like, nah, you know, no, you're not good enough as a flanker, mate. Right, let's get ourselves some points. Perfect is taking a three. Did Fiji win the Pacific Nations? Yeah, effectively they didn't lose. They beat every team, so effectively they won the series. Perfetta! What a kick, son! Good work. We're up 3-0. Not a try, but we're in. We've done well. Right, let's chase this kickoff. We need to score a try, actually, but it's still early days. That's lost. One player, guys. One player wants to join that ruck. No wonder we're not doing that well. Got him. No, I don't got him. Oh Advantage. no. Oh, he's locked. <laughs> Knocked it on. What a silly carrot. I should probably kick it now, shouldn't I? Am I still going to play Rugby Challenge 4 when Rugby 24 releases? Um, it depends how good it is. I'll still finish any series. Like, we're still doing Be a Pro, which we still will be doing Be a Pro. I'll finish that because I don't think it's got to be a pro series. But if it's actually a good rugby game. Crouch, um, bind. Then we'll, yeah, we'll go through. Set. We'll probably alternate a bit, I guess. Might do, um... It depends how editable it is as well. That's the thing that makes Rugby Challenge really good, is you can just edit the teams and change the players so you can update them yourself. You can get fan hub, guys. Oh, damn you. Uh, so you can keep it, keep it current. Uh, rugby 22 and that, you can't really do it. Okay, well, I just chased back for no reason. So we'll see how it is. See how good it is. If you can do that, why is this headgear broken? Um, then we might switch to that if it plays well. And how it plays AI versus AI too. What's up, James? Haven't watched you in years. Was a hooker in one of your teams in the subscriber series. Well, yeah, speaking of subscriber series, we've just started a new one. Season 5. If you want to be back in the, back in the mix, you're more than welcome. I remember the name, James Hudson, that season, that was one of the early seasons, wasn't it? Pretty sure it was. Yeah, we haven't done Subscriber Series for a while, so, but we are back, we're back into it. Um, I'm getting some more time, I've lost that ball, as you can tell, the fact I'm actually streaming, so I thought we'll bring back the Subscriber Series, bring back the Be A Pro, Subscriber Series, oh, we might turn that over, oh, we are. 
So, um, I'll go that way, actually. So, yeah, if you want to crack into it, feel free. Release. I'll just chuck you on there on from this, if you like. Turn that over, turn it over, let's go. Oh, come on, yep. We got it, we got it. Who's taking over my scrum half position? Oh, that was a good little, good little tasty pass. Advantage. Oh, why'd you knock it on? What a dire game this is. As I say, that Northland make a, a very tasty little break. <laughs> Eat that! Everyone's having a, a crazy fit because the camera's spinning around like nothing else. Do I have to make some more tackles? I think I do. Get up, Dunham, score! Oh no! Yeah, you gotta play on PC, North Melbourne. That's where you're going wrong, dude. You play on PC, you download some mods, and you can, um. Yeah, just update your game like that. Fan hub works, you just don't get the kits as well. Oh, rank one and two didn't have fan hub though, did it? Ah, that's, you see, that's why. What was license? New Zealand, Australia, Super Rugby Premiership, ITM Cup, and French competitions. Okay, top 14. That's pretty much everything though, isn't it? Like, what else does that leave? At that time, it would be the Pro 14 or Pro 12. No, there's much else. International sides, really. Oh, no. I fought off the tackle. Shh, don't let him get away. Boys, chase that hard. Chase, chase, chase. Get back, get back, get back. We can't afford to lose this. It's not a great kick, is it, really? If I put players on side, would be... We're going to miss another tackle. Get in, lads. Get in, get in. 20 minutes to play. Still, still not over yet. Good work. Don't let him through. Don't let him through. Don't let him through. I can't stop it. I've, I've no say in this mall whatsoever. I can bash the shit out of the buttons. Nothing happens. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Turn over. Oh, come on, ref. Have some compassion for the little man. Is that a drop goal? I think that was a drop goal attempt. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Find the spaces. Oh, munched. Go! Support him! It's a two on one! It's a three on one! Oh, he's got it to touch! I can't believe I've not scored a try yet! How crazy is this game? Northland's defense has been annoyingly very good. Not winning that. Oh, put the head in. Get it, Sean. Spread it wide. Get on the outside, boys. I'm coming across. Advantage. Oh, he's knocked it on. Oh, I've missed another tackle. Northland have got numbers, and they've knocked it on. Thank goodness for that. That was a bit close. Far out. This game's a bit crazy. A lot crazy. There's knock on one. Don't really want to see knock on Crouch. one or two. Find. Let's see. Sit. Let's steal this ball. 13 minutes to play. We trail by four. Oh, what a scrum. Two amazing hits. Let's go, boys. Are you coming? He's not coming. Release. He could have come with me and we would have been right. He didn't want to. We've got to do this the hard way, I think, lads. Over here, left side. Oh, he couldn't pass. Quick ball, quick ball. Why do I get tackled like that? Go! Just run straight! Run straight for the line! Score the damn try! Don't do anything dumb! Got it! Finally! Oh man, that was crazy! 8-7. Benefit or another kick. Pro 12 is also licensed, but South African Super Rugby teams aren't licensed. There's no Curry Cup. Oh, okay. That's not too... That's pretty good effort for the first game, though. It was Sean! Oh, Sean, you beautiful man. Right, we're up. 
We're up in the lead, finally. We haven't scored our try, though. Wait on, Peter Fitter, please. Far out. We've done very poorly. We need a try. Drop goal, I don't really care about. But we need a try. Holy heck, as we need a try. 10-7. Eight. So, seven minutes to play. Not got long. We've not got long. Don't join, don't. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Yeah, I'm the halfback, bitch. Get out of my way. I don't know, actually, sure I've seen the NPC games today. North Melbourne, honestly. It's a high shot, though. Is Steven Pinofetti going to line up a monster of a kick? Today's Friday. There should be some today, actually. There will be some today. 55. Oh, he is going to. What a dick. Why is he such a clown? Or the captain. Who's the captain? Not me. He's going to get it too, isn't he? He's going to... That doesn't help me, Stephen, does it? And not a piece at all. Does not help me at all. Don't, don't, don't. Oh, no. My ball retention isn't great. But we've hung on. That's all right. Let's go. Dummy. Ball retention, boys. I'm going to go on the backs. Oh, there's a wee gap. No, don't, 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 don't. Oh, no. We've done nothing in this game. Our rating is going to be like a two. If that, it'll be like a one. We played like crap. Benefit to save us. 13 7. We got the win. We got very little ball, though. How did I play? Two line breaks, five tackles, two contests, four handling errors. I don't like my chance of getting good rating here, lads. I don't like it at all. Man, we only got two. Oh, no. We lost mental. We lost catching. We lost passing. <sighs> Bad day at the office. A 3.9. How was that a 3.9? Like, how? Like, let's add it up. 0.7. Plus 0.5, plus 0.6, plus 0.4. So that's 1. That's 2.2. Where'd the rest come from? Like, what does this ratings even mean? And then you got a minus 0.5 because of 7. Holy hell, missed tackles and 4 handing errors. That should have been a 1.6. How the hell is it a 3.9? I don't know. I don't know. Is it go up based on the difficulty of the team or something? I don't know. But man, I'll take it. Tearing up one, north and up ten, no one else gave a shit. Right, how did that Ram Freddy Shield game go? And we'll check out if we're far from Astra USA. Southland won. 35 20 over Otago. Next defense is Counties, who we play today. Why? Why are these fixtures out to get us? Why are they out to get us? I don't know. Are we 72 rated? No. No, we've dropped! <laughs> I thought we were 71. Oh, God. Here we go. USA. Oh, we're up high. We're just over, um... We're just over halfway on USA. Just over halfway, which is good. Counties is playing Bad Plenty. It starts at 7 hours. That'll be about right. That's about 7 p.m. Which is about normal time for a game to start off down here. Right, let's play. We're, 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 we're playing counties now. You can see we are pretty up on, on play kicker as well. Line break, running meters. You can see this one penalty. Kicking meters. Oh, handling error. We need to achieve that handling error this time. We need to achieve that. How long till the World Cup starts? 21 hours, 19 minutes? Yep. I don't know why the screen goes so bright in that point. It's very bizarre. Hit the pole! Oh. I don't get very good pole hitters here on these streams. There we go. That's better. Although, you probably can't beat the uh, crossbar. Uh, cross, crossbar? Crossbar. Hit we did yesterday. Right, let's go. Counties versus Taranaki. 
What have they got? Tamatini. Okay, that's a bit of a matchup. Huipa. Didn't we play these guys in preseason? I think we did. Am I going to watch that match? Uh, possibly. I don't know. Why is Naholo on the bench? Oh, it's the other Naholo, isn't it? We've got both Naholos. I don't know, man. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. I don't religiously tune into all the MP NPC games. It depends what I've got to edit. Depends what I've got to prepare and stuff like that. I spend most of my night editing. So I spend all day recording and um, all night editing and all morning streaming. <laughs> so I don't do much else. Oh, I got the tackle there. No counties are just about through. Which team do I least like in the NPC? Um, Release. Oh, what? How have we lost that? Uh, least like. Oh, no, it's pretty easy to not like Auckland. Maybe counties, actually. Count uh, oh, my God. What an intercept that is. Oh, what a pass. We finally get some ball, and it gets snaffled off us like that. Get it. Yes, good work. Pass, pass, pass. Okay, or not. Oh, why are we losing the ball so quickly? Oh, he's bulldozed this for the try. Or has he? Oh, what a piece of defense. Turnover. Offload. Five meter scrum. Oh. Bind. Set. Turnover scrum. I don't know, man. I'm trying to think of who I don't like. Auckland. I gotta get kicking meters here. Advantage. I'm gonna drop it. Never try and kick the ball when you're that close to a defender. That has screwed us again for handing errors. We failed that again. So now we're gonna be even less on passing and catching. And we're probably gonna concede. We're having a shocking game Advantage here. Advantage over. Oh, he's gonna go straight through. Straight through us. Our defense is garbage. Who do I like the least? I don't really know. Probably Auckland. Probably just Auckland. Do you know what is the best watching rugby while eating? <laughs> well, it's 7 o'clock. It's pretty good for um, eating times. Come on, Riley. Get it over with, mate. Come on. There we go. Right, we're going to come back again. We're not having a good game. We're not having a good day, actually, of this, are we? A beer pro has been garbage. We played really good in the preseason game. But now, proper season, we're playing like a piece of crap. He's going to kick. He's going to kick. I got this. I got this. I got this. I don't got it. Maybe I do. Oh, sidestep. Oh, I can't even sidestep one guy. Release. Get out, I can't see what's going on. Oh, a sidestep. We actually go, no, go, go left side, left side, mate. Go, go, run. Oh, it's a kick. Don't go out, don't go out, don't go out. We're going to win this race. We're going to win this race. Dive on it. Put it down. Oh, no. Oh, he got it. It was Pinafetta. He got it and he went dead. Oh, no. Oh, that's disaster. Utter disaster. Funny though, but utter disaster. Right, let's get some lads. Yes, keep it spinning. It keeps... Oh, brilliant! Little grubber! Regather! Score it! Oh, he's been held up! Oh, for goodness sake! I don't know what you do in New Zealand, but in South Africa, every time the Springboks play... Most of the South Africans bry and eat. Hang on, the heart's covering that. What is that? I can't even say it. Bry, 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 bry I, I try and pronounce every letter. That's where I go wrong with this stuff, you know? It's no try. We know it's no try. While the Springboks eat. I've seen Crouch. that. I've seen this. It's like Fine. barbecuing sort of stuff, right? Except more, Sit. way more cultural. 
Kind of like a hungy, I guess, like Māori people do. Here's where he snipe. One man to beat. Oh, no, he's been smoked. Oh, we have lost the ball. One phase, one chance. <laughs> I'm trying to get in good positions here. You take the tackle. Good. Forwards, do some damn work for once. Oh, monstered. Max was watching Sam and tried the same play. Two similar positions, you see, that's why. Look at that, barnstorming run. Get in, get in, get in, boys. We've got to score here. Oh, there's a gap, there's a gap, slide in. Oh, just about. Recycle, quick, quick, quick. Use the forwards. He's offside, Rev. He is offside. I'll take this, please. Round. Straighten up. Oh, brilliant try. That is a great try. It means the meat that you bribe. Nice. And I've seen that. I, don't, I know South African culture is very much here. In New Zealand, I'd say people probably just go get drunk. <laughs> New Zealand has a terrible drinking culture. This is a nice... I like this try. Look at this. Straight up. Bang. Dummy. Slide through. Easy. We don't have anything cool like that. I said that they don't even make hungies and stuff like they used to. Like that sort of sport culture thing. They do probably for the Warriors. Like the NRL. The league. That's probably more of a thing like that. Rugby is just... Off to the pub. I guess. It's probably the closest thing we've got to like an eating culture or... Or doing something culture of New Zealand rugby. As you know, most people don't even go to the games. Which is a bit sad. I suppose Dunedin sold out for the uh, Wallabies game. Which is good to see. Around the corner, mate, if you want it. Okay, we'll just there. Oh, there's an alcoholic beverages, North Melbourne. Oh, what an inside ball! Run it in, son! That is a great try! Brilliant try! Oh, the put down as well. If that was full time, that would have been magical. I've done nothing in this game either. Cold beers, cold whiskey, cold bourbon, cold vodka, cold whatever. Mainly in the, in the culture wise, it would be beer. The All Blacks are sponsored by brands like Steinlager and all that sort of stuff. So, beer culture is very much All Black culture. Now, uh, you'll see when they win trophies, they fill it up with beer and drink it. Bad or good or whatever, the difference is 14-7. We've got to play better, actually. We've got to play a lot better. What do we got to do, actually? I've, I'm not really concentrating. Okay, I've got to get kicking meters. And I've already made a handing error, so that's... Yeah, my bad. Kicking meters. We can do that. We're going to Australia this year. Awesome. Their culture is very much like our culture in terms of alcoholic drinking. I'm here, buddy. Okay, just cut us all out. That's all right. Little round passes. Nice. Nice. Can we run them to the corner? Oh, yes! What a pass that is! Sensational from Max. And Waisaki is in for another try. And we extend our lead. What month are you going? When about see you going, North Melbourne? You should go to... Oh, no, so... What's going to be on later on this year? Oh, you're going for a whole year. I thought they said later in the... Man, I need to read better. I missed some of what... It was that Cullum say that it was him on Twitch when it, I read it wasn't. Now, it said for a year. So if you're there for a whole year, you should get to a Wallabies game. You'll be able to go to a Wallabies, um, All Blacks, Springboks. This will be a proper rugby championship next year. Super Rugby will be on. Um, the Super Round, is it? That is in Melbourne, I think. Nice. Well, you'll get a, you'll get a full rugby, Super Rugby season over there. And who knows what else. Oh, high shot. 21-7 is the score. We're doing damage here, boys. We're doing damage. Damage. Love it. 
Get off the field, prick. Let's go, boys. Kick to touch. Time to score a try, I think. In the 22. Are we in? No, not quite in the 22. Let's go to the back. Good work. Okay, we got it eventually. Short ball. Nice. Go, Sean. Straight out the middle. Numbers left and right, Sean. Pass. Good ball. Off to Waisaki. What? What's going on here? How the hell have we not scored that? Got itchy nose this afternoon, this evening, this morning, for some reason. Don't know why. But how do we not score that try? That is ridiculous. So many numbers, so many players, so many opportunities, and so many lost ball. Time to make some tackles. Put another hit. Oh, nice. We gonna turn that? No, not quite. Short and wide. Just kicked it. What an ugly kick. That was a poor pass. Oh, illegal tackle. Tip tackle ref. Stupid maul. Come back this way. I shouldn't chase the ball. I should just stay in my spot. It's a nine. Stay here, stay here, stay. Okay, now we can help. Of course, I've used their numbers. They are doing good at the moment, County. So, still got a man in the bin. How is this happening? Get him. Oh, no, he skimmed us again. Not the first time this match, that's for sure. We're coming back for another go. Oh, brilliant from Counties. Counties aren't bad. 21-12 to Vita Nabrura. I think he played for the Highlanders, didn't he, around uh, a couple of years ago. It's 2.09 a.m. <laughs> Why are you up so late, man? What did we, when did we start? Okay, we started, oh, that's right. It was just before midnight, wasn't it? Because we were waiting on the um, the uh, Sam Lewis episode to go live, weren't we? Did that go live? Uh, we, we checked, didn't we? It did go live, didn't it? Yeah, it went live. You're right, we're so close to 11k. Oh, he's missed the kick. Good, 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 good. We've got a few votes on that already. Jeez, I think we know where we're going. A lot of people voting for the Druid. For Sam Lewis. Looks like we might be off the NRC. Burnt Cabbage, I see you there, buddy, with your, uh, your comment. Drew by far, I think it is. By far, by far. You always up this late? Yeah, I quite like staying up late. Oh, crap. I, I try, I try to get up a bit earlier so I can actually stream a bit earlier. Oh, God damn it. Run faster, dude. How is that not a turnover, ref? Oh, we got it eventually. Fine. I'll let that slide. It wasn't mine, but now he's injured. Matteli's injured. Are you going to go to bed early to watch World Cup games? Um, I'll probably be sleeping during the day, honestly. Because World Cup games are on from like 11 p.m. till... I think the late ones start at 7 a.m. So, find... I'll pick and choose. I'll probably watch the Sit. late games and then get up early for the early games. So, my watch along streams will be me falling asleep, half asleep. Why didn't he pass that to me? Oh, what a garbage play, guys. Okay, we got the ball. Uh, we need to kick him in this, don't we, actually? Given the game, and the context, and the score. Here we go. Kicking me this complete. We'll leave this chase. Oh, good tackle. Great offload, but. Good tackle. They are going backwards here. Not releasing. Penalty. Penalty to Naki. 
I wish the games run a little bit earlier or later. But it is what it is. It's France. It's, that's just how it is. And that's, that's all good. Yeah, so you're about the opposite. Yeah, I think the, the late game, Pitovic is taking a shot at goal here. 21, make it 24. The late games, so the 7 a.m. games will go to about, yeah, 19. And daylight saving changes as well during the World Cup. Which kind of makes it a little bit more confusing. Because that'll mean games will start at 7-11, they'll start at 12, and they'll start at 8 instead of 7. So that'll be a bit shit, but it's what it is. Good take, good take, Max. Wish we get some better flankers here. That would be nice. Can you get lads? Do your work forwards. We're not playing nine this time. We're going to wait for that pass. That never come, and now we've lost it. Oh, that was almost another turnover for us. Let's make a tackle or two, shall we? Oh, that's time. Have I scored a try in this game? I really don't think I have. Oh, luckily we got him just before, and through they go. Counties looking for a bonus point. Shut them down. Turn it over. Oh, yep. We will. I think we'll just smash this into touch, honestly. There it is. We'll take it. We'll take a win. W's all around for us here. Japan was very good times for the World Cup. Yeah, so they started late afternoon, if I'm not mistaken. Because we are... New Zealand is a few hours ahead of Japan. So if their afternoon game started early evening and they went into the late night, but no later than midnight sort of time. We didn't score a try. Maka and Nabrua got one each. Naholo and Walden got two. Good work. 24-12. I'll take that. Three handing errors, two line breaks, six tackles, two contests. Nice. Not our best game. But we are playing garbage rugby today for some reason. I don't know why. Four out of five. Wow. Look at those decreases on catching and passing. Piss off game. Massive increase on speed though. Look at that. 2.2 and 1.5. I think we lost two points on catching. Our catching is terrible. We need to sort that crap out. Four greens though. And a 3.4. Taranaki went up point plus four, which is good. Means they're, they're positive. It was a happy game. So that's all good. You'll watch two more matches. I think that's probably about all we're going to um, stream for, to be honest with you, North Melbourne. Uh, the way things are going. We've got news, actually. What's this? Oh, go away. Performed poorly over eight matches. Oh, get out of here. Matali's out for three weeks. We're performing adequately. So who's in now? Jackson Ormond. Okay, we've lost a bit there. He's a bit shit. Uh, we don't have... I mean, the other Naholo would have been better. Got so many players away on international duty. Lord and Vaille aren't. I don't know why they aren't, but it's all right. So we've got Auckland. Uh, does Southland hold on to the shield? No! Oh, Kelties! We just beat Kelties at home! <sighs> this game hates us. It really does. 12-10. What a shield game. What a shield game. So now counties will defend it against Wellington. When do we play Wellington? If Wellington win, of course. So we play Tasman. Oh, oh, it's an away game. Damn it. So we won't, we don't get a shield challenge. So we have to hope that someone like, uh, who else? Auckland. We play them now. We're not going to get a shield game, god damn it. We're just not going to get a shield game. Oh well, this is what it is. Right, 24 kicking meters. Handing her is in there again. Three tackles, score a try, and can see less than one penalty. I mean, it's hard to... We, we need to not make a handing error. That's it. That is it. Time flies so fast. To time flies so fast. Not very long until we must wait four more years until a Rugby World Cup. <laughs> it's alright, you enjoy it while it's here That's what you do We're only 21 days away That's 3 weeks 
Literally, we are three weeks away. Three weeks and one day. Effectively. There's Max, look at that. Lumberjack Max with his ginger hair. Ginger everything. Right, what's up here? Angus Stoutvale's playing for Auckland. Ali and B will be playing for Auckland soon. Plummet. Ruru. Fayani. Belair. Clark. Barry. I'm going to smash Caleb Clark. Isles? Is that Carlin Isles? Oh, no. Surely not. To see Tyler. Interesting. Interesting. Right, let's beat Auckland. Yeah, we'll beat Auckland. We'll beat whoever's next. Um, and then we'll probably uh, wrap up for today. But we'll, I'll try to come back tomorrow morning. We'll play some more. Try to get through the season. Probably won't get through the season tomorrow. Maybe. We might actually. But Monday we will. World Cup start on a Friday or a Saturday? Um, Saturday, technically. Sunday morning down here. Fr is it Friday? Oh, no, you're right. Franklin. Oh, we've scored. So Saturday, it's a Saturday for me because it's the next morning. But it's a Friday night local. How confusing. How confusing. Local time. Local time, it starts. When's that first game? Quarter past nine. That is really late. I suppose there'll be an opening ceremony as well. So, that'll probably be a Friday evening before the game. They'll dance and do all this sort of crap. So, yeah, Friday Friday night locally. Saturday morning uh, in the south. So, for Australia, for us, it'll be Saturday morning in New Zealand. But... Then we've got games. Four games on Saturday night locally. Or Saturday. So a lot of games there. Oh man, we are struggling to hold on to the ball here. It's hard. It's a halfback. You can't really influence much. We've got to make tackles though. I, don't, I just want to default hit rucks. That's not a tackle. I suppose normally you'd, you'd sit around at the back. That's a tackle, though. That is a great tackle. Caleb Clark, get yeah, some of that, Caleb. You should be playing NPC, not in the All Blacks. First round of the World Cup, we have tough matches. France versus New Zealand. South Africa versus Scootland. Oh, the Scoots. Are they going to make the final like they did in the... Uh, Advantage. Mock World Cup this morning. Imagine that. Imagine Australia versus Scotland. Robbed of a try. Robbed of a World Cup win. Crouch. Bind. It's about two months Set. of Melbourne. Roughly. <laughs> Don't know how many matches I'm going to be streaming on, but we'll try to do a lot if we can. Another tackle. Two good hits. Don't know what that was. Massive swing around. Don't let them score, boys. We are up 7-0. I'll cover this side. I got him. It's Caleb Clark. <laughs> He's got no chance. You call him the bully. He ain't getting past this little nugget. And this little Max Wilson nugget is going to shut him down. Shouldn't follow the ball so much. I've been size six. Oh, they've scored. That was a nice try. But we got skinned. Skinned by a very good sidestep. Talia. Taliana Talia. I wonder if that's supposed to be Mark Talia. Surely. Like, surely, right? That's just his... Adopted name? Dunno, or are these two Talias? Dunno. Dunno. He's got hair on this one, though. South Africa's got a tough pull. Everyone's got a tough pull. Everyone's got a tough pull. Even Australia. <laughs> Poor Aussies. 
wonder if they're paying out if Eddie Jones will quit during the Rugby World Cup. Come on, boys, let's go. Let's get ourselves back in the lead. It's 7 7. Auckland have scored the try. How's that not a turnover? We need tackles. We need to start playing some damn rugby, man. We are so bad at the moment. Turn that, turn that over. Nope. I want to get out. Let me out. I'll just sit at the back here, around the fringe. Oh, falling off another tackle. It's all right. Oh, that intercept should have gone. Oh, they're load shedding the power. I find that the most messed up crap ever. How do you deal with that stuff? Those don't really have a choice. You just gotta. Like, I didn't even make that tackle. You just gotta deal with it, don't you? Advantage. Knock on. Knock on, Auckland. Let's go, boys. Coast to coast. And then, and then, and then. Pick, 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 pick. Advantage the outside. Oh, what a pass. I like that. That was good. That was good. Okay, you play scrum half then. Just find me. I'm to the left. Or not. We are here waiting. No. No. Yes. Yes. Got it. How do you deal with that shit, man? Like, I know you don't really have a choice, but... It seems absurd that that can just be done, right? Like, I don't know. I, I know. I don't know the full details like you guys will, but I just see it's like, oh, we've only got what the hell was that? Is that a drop goal? No. Only got power between the hours of this and this. Crouch, bind. I don't understand it, man. Set. Build a power plant. Build some more windmills. I don't know. Advantage. Oh, another knock on. Also, it's not regular. Most of the people get it in South Africa, but at my house, they had load shooting two months ago. Other people Crouch. were had load shooting today. Bind. Weird. Set. So weird. <laughs> People would riot in the streets if that crap happened here. Pass! Oh! Max! There'll be super riots in the street. Especially when they didn't have power. It'll be like, right, I'm going to the streets. What are you doing, man? Run forward, you clowns! Okay, short side. No, short side's gone. Forwards! Oh, I should use the forwards. Straight up, straight up, score! Yes! We'll take the lead into the break. Well done. Who scored that? Oh, Ty Warden. Good job. Come on, Pinafetta. Yes, we're up. What do you do when it's, when it's your time? Like, what do you actually do? The world is so dependent on power, and, you know, that's still sort of anything that uses power. Like, read a book? I don't get it. Well, I get it, but I don't, I don't. <sighs> What's the word? Think it's a great idea? Clearly? All right, lads, let's go. Why not Oh, no! Oh, no! We've been injured! Oh, no! Uh-oh. <sighs> we don't want to watch the game. We're not in the game. Oh, no! We still won! <laughs> what was the score? 24 20. Wow, Plummer got a drop goal. 
We made five tackles. We didn't make an error though, so maybe our handling will go up? I don't know. Right. We got three. Didn't make a handing error, didn't concede a penalty, we didn't score a try. Oh, we didn't kick our, any ball away. Passing and catching went up. Well, that's good. Because that was what we were lacking. But we're broken. We're broken. Ooh, 1.2. That's bad. That is bad. That is so bad. Right. Oh, 88 days. Our season is over. Our season is over. 88 days. It's seven weeks. My real name is Steve. Steven. Steve. I'm, I'm like Peter Fetter, except that's not my last name. But just Steve. People call me Steve or, um, or Cornflake, if you prefer it, whatever. Not fussed. 14 weeks, man. 14 weeks. Jared Prophet has been suspended as well. I mean, what are we looking at here? 88 days. Wellington's got the shield. Two, three. There's only six games of the season left. We're still first. Advance, I guess. Okay, we've been Canterbury. Whoa! Hello. That was only five day turnaround. We've been Tasman. That is correct. That's what I go by, North Melbourne. You're right. We've beaten everyone here. Down to 70. We're done. Our season's over. We've smashed Wellington. Why are we so good? Oh, one pointer over Waikato. Wow. I should remember that, Daniel. I should remember that because North Melbourne is weird to say as a name. <laughs> and you can't split it and say North or Melbourne. Well, Daniel's the name. I'll remember that. I'll write it down. That's probably a good idea. 59 days. We've smashed Hawks Bay. Where's the shield, actually? Canterbury's got it. <sighs> Southland lost the shield challenge. Oh, no. Oh, we could have got it back. Where did Canterbury win it? Oh, there they are. They beat Wellington. Wellington held it a week. Canterbury defended against Waikato. Didn't matter against North Harbour. They, oh, they beat Southland by two points. We could have had a shot at it. But we wouldn't have been playing, so it wouldn't have mattered. Last game of the season. 53 days out still. We've smoked Southland. Uh, Warwick Lamert is out. I think we will have to stay in the NPC for another season. We're going to miss some of it. Oh, no, we should be fit by the new... Well, we might get contracts. I don't know. Semi-finals. We're playing counties. Here's how the season finished. Top of the table. We'll... They don't even need me. They're 10 from 10. What an incredible team. They're just beating everyone. Canterbury second. We'll place counties. And, man, Canterbury and Tasman. That's a bit unfair, isn't it? Okay, we're into the final. We've beaten counties. What's this? Another injury? Oh, Matali suspended. So he's back from injury and now he's suspended. 39 days left. Taranaki Tasman. Grand final of the NPC. Oh, we did it. Back-to-back -back champions, Taranaki. Yes. Does that go on our um statistics, is it? It does. Yes. Back-to-back -back champions. Doesn't matter. We only played four games. We are back-to-back -back champions. Oh, and it's simulating through. We've got contracts. We've got contracts. Hold the phone, everyone. We've got contracts. Right, Daniel. Anyone who asks us here? Franklin, if you saw about. Oh, we got the Kings. <laughs> Do we leave Taranaki and go to the Kings? We've got a contract offer from the Kings. I want to go. I vote go to the Kings. A hundred grand, that's tripling our pay. Over tripling our pay. What do you reckon? Kings? Accept it, go Kings. I say we accept it too. A 
It's a pretty unanimous sort of thing, is it? There have been two seasons at the Naki. Back to back for the NPC. We'll go to the Kings. What do we check out? Do we play a game, a preseason game for the Kings? Maybe we'll play one game um, before we wrap up. Next, next stream, though, anyone who's not tuned into this one will be like, what the hell? We're at the Kings. One contract offer. We go to the Kings. It's unanimous. Most people are going to sleep by now. We'll be in the Pro 14. It should... Yeah, it's not the URC, but whatever. We're accepted. We're done. One game for the Kings. We'll go through preseason. Scotland beat Ireland. There you go. All your Scottish fans out there. They've done it again. Why are we still at... What? Is it because the uh, competition doesn't change? That's weird. Why are we still here? Let's go through preseason. I don't want to play preseason. Okay. Whew. Player drafting. Hopefully we move now. Oh, thank God. I was like, oh, the game's broken. Oh, the game's broke. No. Okay, we get to, we had one preseason game we could have played. Stuff that, don't care. Now we're a king. We are a king of rugby. Yes, boys. Right. Player achievements, don't care. Um, Juan Manuel Gamanada has been selected to play for Uruguay. Here we go. Some of the kings have announced the signing of former Taranaki scrum half Max Wilson for the 2022 Kids Pro 14 competition. Yeah, high expectations, better players. And John Quill has been selected. John Quill! Oh, we've found we've found a USA teammate! Yes! Yes, you're right, actually. John Quill. There he is. Look! Oh, we're playing right next to our American mates! Look at that! Quill at seven. We're at nine. We've got Mud the Toy. This is a pretty crap team, isn't it? I remember JC Astle. Who's our backs? Zono, Kruger, Klassen, Basson, Basson. Ulrich Byers, surely we've got some good players in here. Cyril Pretorius, we've kicked him out. Oh, Satoli. Doesn't look like him. Unguru, we've got Isaac Curtis Harris. These guys all on the bench, of course, on the reserves. Not a great team, I'll be honest. That guy there, James Doyle, should probably be playing 73 rated. Or maybe not, actually. Decent. Average pack. We're going to struggle. We are going to struggle this year, team. I won't I won't lie. <laughs> this team looks pretty crap. What's our rating? 77.61? Competition info? Okay. Oh, it's split to two pools. Well, that's progressive. Uh, what's our schedule then? We've got Treviso. Or Benetton Treviso Rugby. What are they? 70? Okay, we're better than them. Okay, we're better than Munster. Not better than Leinster. Cheetahs. Oh, so this is, this must be Pro 14 just before it changed names. That's all right. Connet, Blues, Zebri, Glasgow, Dragons, Leinster Blues, Ospreys, Scarlets, Ulster. Oh my God, it's a long season. Wow. We're probably going to get injured through this. Uh, so we'll see how we go. We play pretty much everyone, it seems. How many rounds is there? 21 rounds. Right, well, let's get the one out of the way um, and play our first match for the Southern Kings. We're playing Benetton, the Italians. Just want to see if anything's changed. Still 71 rated. Okay, well, no, we're still good. We're still good. Let's go. Let's play this first game. And then that'll about do us for today, I think, because being out about as usual as we have, most of you guys in the North Walker heading off to bed, so I'll let you sleep at like 6 million a.m., what are these kits? I'm going to have to fix the kits. These aren't the right kits. These aren't the right kits at all. Oh, well, we're playing one game in the shit kits. We'll have to fix them up. What are we going to do? Kicking meters? Handing errors? Line break? Running meters? Cathedral? Okay, we'll do it as we go. I don't know what these kits are. I can fix them up between. I'll try to fix them up tonight. While I continue making the, um, what are these kits? They look like crap. 
Think you'll be selected for America this season? Well, it's a long season, so we'll, yeah. John Quill just got called up, so they're obviously playing at the moment. So we'll see how it goes. Look at these kits. Oh, they're both disgusting. Oh, throwing up in my mouth. Oh, well, we'll fix these up. We'll fix... Why have they got no faces? Oh, there we go. Okay, the, the Ford pack have got no faces. It's all falling apart. The game's just like, I've, I've been running too long today. I'm going to die. We're up against uh, Tabordi, the Italian scrum half. Tommaso Allen. They've got a very good team. Rossi, Benvenuti, Haywood at the back. This is a very good team. Uh, they'll play for every international window. So, yeah, they'll play the typical when all the other teams play. So they'll play... Uh, they played... What did they play? They played something that just... In last season with Taranaki because someone got caught up to play against America. It, it sucks being the Kings and playing in blue. This is... This is horrible. This isn't the teams at all. Oh, well, we'll fix it up. Penalty Kings! Oh, it feels weird to not say Taranaki. Penalty Kings! Yeah, they'll play like a, an America... South America... Uh, competition or North America competition, so they'll play Canada. Uh, it possibly will be that competition they play against, like the Māori All Blacks as well. Uh, who else do they play? Some of the Pacific Islands. So we'll see how they go. Should have brought Peter Feta with us. We're playing at Newlands, by the way, which is I can live with that. We're up three nil. I don't know if I haven't touched the ball yet. I uh, will fix all these Pro 14 kits. I thought they were. Oh, they might, might be selected wrong. Some of them have kits, that's for sure. Clearly started with the two that don't. He's in touch. Got two running meters for that. Good work. The beard doesn't go with the blue, does it? It really doesn't. Right, Aston. You're up on this one, JC. Or not. Oh, we've held that up nicely. Get a tackle. Oh. Straight through the gap. I hate it when you just go to tackle a guy and he passes it. And you can't tackle him. That's a turnover. Let's. I need some tackles here, boys. Oh, no. Not like that. That's a bad tackle. A turnover kicking meters hello no i'm gonna pass that that goal's gonna smash me we made the break there so that's a good kick that guy was gonna tackle before we got the ball away and that was gonna mean i would have knocked it on smart gotta be gotta, gotta think smart here astol you're in the action again mate oh, they've come forward faster than us i need to make a tackle just run 50 meters across field to do nothing. Everyone's beat me to the punch. That's a turnover though. Where's our forwards? Short side, forwards. Go, go, go. Another kick, really? All right, can I tackle him, please? Advantage. Ooh, he's locked it on. Ah. It's got the logo there. I'm, I'm a bit perplexed why these kits aren't working. I'm sure they're on here. They're just clearly selected. Crouch. Them. We'll find. fix it. We'll fix it. Sit. Don't worry. <laughs> Got 20 games to play this season. That is horrifically a huge amount. We're going short side. Oh, tried to get around him. Good win, good win. Keep it in the forwards. Keep it tight. Secure position. Get up, you useless slug. I can't see what's happening. Are we going to screw our first try? Woo, we are, yeah, we got one, woohoo! 8-0, who scored? Was that Zolzo guy? Oh no, Byers. Is he in midfield? No, he's a fullback. Uh, there should be every team kit on here, but it's probably either got jumbled up with selecting them or it's been overwritten, possibly. So I'll look after this. Yeah, we'll, we'll do, get all the Pro 12 or Pro 14 teams. Or URC teams, whatever. Hopefully, if I can find them. And the ball as well, because it says Elite 14. Try to fix that. 
Mobs aren't as easy to come by. Oh, that was close for Rugby Challenge 4. <clears throat> but I think there is, maybe not up to date as in 2023 season, but they'll be fairly new. I'm not actually sure we've got premiership teams. We'll find out. We need to fix this for Sam anyway. Because Sam's going, well, going by the comments, a little bit of a, an early tip for you guys. It's looking Druer 100%. So I need to make sure we got the Druer kits. Although, NRC licensed? I don't think it is. We've stolen that. That's a good work. Now, Wilson. Oh, we're spinning. And we've run our, done our running meters. That's good. I was going to kick that, but we got into a bit of a scuffle before we got... Advantage. Oh, he's dropped it. Now instead. We'll try and get all the teams fixed up, buddy. See what we can do. Advantage over. Tavisos advantage is over. That one's going to screw it into touch. Quick line out, mate. Quick line out. Okay, or not. Or not. It's all right. You don't need to do a quick line out. Let's go. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. Why did it go a bit glitchy? No, oh, we've given the ball away. I need to make some tackles. Here's one. Oh, no. Oh, I missed him as well. Why are we so bad? Why? Oh, here's a try. Oh, what? What was that pathetic effort from the fullback? Jeez, he just like watched him go over. Love that splash screen. Scarby scores. Treviso are in. And they're one point behind. We rock it out. Lots for the World Cup. I tell you what. More comments for the drawer? It's drawer everywhere. Right, chase this. I need to make tackles. I need to make kicks. I need to play some rugby. I've done nothing. Is that not a tackle? Like, surely holding a guy out for a maul is a tackle, right? <sighs> Don't let him get... Release. I miss so many tackles. The more tackles I try to make, the more I miss. It's really bad. Right, round the fringe. I got him, I got him, I got him. Yeah, I got one. Woo. Oh, we've turned it over too. And we've lost it. Have we? Yeah. Yeah, it's gone. It's gone. Got him. Nice tackle, nice. Max. What's that, half time? Already? Man. I want to see the King's kits, man. Kick it out. Or oh, just kick it straight down the middle of the park. I'm back here with you, buddy. Whoever you are, I forgot your name. Oh, okay, I'll take that. Yep. Into touch. Good work. Well done. Half time. 40 minutes of action remains. Of our opening game of a, as a Pro 14 player. What have we done? Sweet stuff all. What have we done? Okay, we've done just about everything bar a line break. Wow. Exactly our running meters. Right, we need to make a line break. That's what we need to do here, boys. Oh, that completed our kicking meters. Nice, nice, nice. Line break incoming, boys. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, there was a huge hole there. How do I make a line break here? Like, oh, Jesus, that pass. That pass is too good here. Mate, on the left. Oh, buddy, have some faith. This is a line break. Yeah, that's a line break. That's not a line break. How is that not a line break? We've got to try. At least got to try. I don't know how that wasn't a line break. Watch. The day this isn't a line break. Line. Break. What more do you want from me, Kings? I don't know what more I can do. It didn't count as a line break, I don't think. That's the problem. Oh, I'm not taking the kick, so I don't need to worry about it.
Got the kick. There we go. 15 7. I'll check it. I'll check it. See if um, it counted. No, it didn't count. Look. That's garbage. I'm insulted. I agree. How is that not a line break? <laughs> we have to do another one. Probably not from back here, though. Tried for an offload. We are in a spot of bother here. This is a bad place to be. Right. There's a bit of room here to the right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, that's, that's a line break. Let kicking meters and chasing meters. Although that guy's quite quick. Okay, we've got a couple players coming with us. Oh, good chase. Turnover. Oh, not quite. Advantage. Oh, great chase. Oh, we're inflicting the game in a big way here. <laughs> the camera is being crazy. Uh oh. Wow, we kept that in. Whew. That was impressive. Crouch. Yeah, we do have a scrum. Fine. Five out. They see we can cook. Set. I don't think I'm going to be able to run off the back, though. Because there's too many players there. I have to use the back line. Let's see what they can do. Oh, they've manipulated well to the shop. What is that? Why would you kick there? You are an absolute fool. You should be dropped for that. It's 15-7. We got our line break, though. I'm pretty sure that counted. It did. Yeah, we are up. We are up. Five from five. Like you say, Daniel, don't drop the ball. No no handing errors. Oh, they've kicked it straight to us. Do I just give it to someone else? I think I do. Mate, I don't know why he kicks. Why is Rugby Challenge AI dumb? I mean, it's a million dollar question. Good tackle. Good tackle. The AI just love... Oh, we've got that. We've got that. Brilliant work. The AI love doing like... Five meter. Yes! Oh, we can't beat the last guy. They love doing little five meter grubber kicks. And the, the scrum halves are the worst. So at least with us being the nine, that won't happen as much. <laughs> but yeah, they love doing it. Oh, he's, he's mine. Dive on it, lads. Dive on it. Don't let him back in the field of play. Making tackles. Making it worse. Good stuff, Max. Not my watch, son. Get up, Max. Oh, you're getting owned here, boys. You're getting owned. Just like that. Just like that. Why? Why would you do a stupid little grubber kick like that? I know we're leading, but man, come on. Get another try. Make everyone look better because we're scoring. Stop fouling. Tell you what, the game's changed, buddy. Since last time you were here, we're in a new team. We've been injured for half a, half a season. Oh. Lunch with your son. That sounds nice, dude. That sounds like a great idea. I cannot, I cannot say that's a worse place to be than this. Does that make sense? That's where you should be. Oh, look at this. How's the pace? It's not good. It's not good. Offload. Into touch. No, this is... Uh, this is game one. I'm pretty sure this is game one. I hope it's not preseason. I didn't check that. We'll find out in about 12 minutes. So it's all changed. Um, okay, I won't ruin it for you. But just excuse the kits because I haven't updated the kits. <laughs> for the league we're in. So you can rewatch it. Um... There's, there's a bit going on in this stream, though. I'll be honest. We've broken stuff. We've fixed stuff. We've ruined stuff. We've made funny stuff. Oh, it's been good fun. It's been good fun. Oh, slip through. Little chip over the top. Bring it back. Get this one. Oh, no. Max. Find. You're doing everything right, but not getting Sick. the results. Good. Good. There's a little hole here. Oh. <laughs> I just want another try. They'll get it anyway. Oh, will they? Yes, they will. Good try. 
game, set, match. Kings win their opening game. These kits disgust me. They absolutely disgust me. I'm going to see if they're actually still around um, after this. Might just be wrongly selected. Maybe not, though. Good try. I like it. Good try. Even if it's a Super Rugby Kings kit, it'll still do fine. 20 points to 7. Excellent work. There's the extra two. Three minutes to play. Yeah, you know what the problem is with that? Is that he's having the game of his life, yeah, but if it is preseason, it doesn't count towards um, ratings. He'll get good, yeah, he'll get good um, skill increases, though, at least, but hey, we get to learn our teammates. That's what matters. That's what matters. Let's wind down the clock here, lads. Keep it tight. Keep it the pods, as they say. Oh, hi! Take a shot at three. Take three. Piss off, mate. Yellow card. You look like you're playing for Portugal. Off you go. Get out. Off. It's my Newlands now. Don't worry about the Stormers. I don't think it is preseason. Tap it first, man. Well, now... If you don't tap... We're going to have to do a line out just so we can kick it out again. And if I make a handling error, I am going to be absolutely fuming. You know what? I'm not going to kick it. <laughs> That's how we roll. Five out of five. Love it. Good stuff. Sensational stuff. The red and blue kings win. I want to see these kits, though. Treviso gave us a little hurry up, though, didn't they? They scored early. It was, what, 7-7, but we shut them down. Uh, Max Boy got his game going, and from there, it was all curtains. I hope we get a rating. One try, four line breaks, 11 tackles, an offload. Holy heck, is you're right. He did play the game of his, of his career. Two handling errors, which is pretty standard. Big increases here, team. Big increases incoming. Come on. Yeah, 72 rated, 5 out of 5, brilliant. Running kicking meters, superb, 134 running meters, 4 line breaks. How do we get 4 line breaks when we struggle to make that 1? Remember we couldn't get 1? Bizarre. No penalties, look at that. Over 1 on fitness, speed, acceleration. Uh, what about handling and passing? 0.9 on passing, 1 on catching, love that. Good, all round good. Now, rating? 5.8! Yeah! That's our best ever. That is our best ever, and you know why? I think it's because it comes down to your opposition. I think that affects your rating. If you play better against better teams, you get better ratings. Against lower-ranked teams, you don't get as well. Maybe. I don't know. But I guess you look at that, and we've got 3.3 .3 on just tackles, running, and tries. 0.8 will give us 4. Yeah, that still wouldn't equal 5.8. But big, look at this. Look at this, Benetton 10, Kings 1, but Bordeaux, Munster, Rebels, Bristol, Ulster, Scarlet, Sale, Toulon, Edinburgh, <gasps> Stade Francais, and Leicester, all getting increases of 4. Love that. All Blacks beat in Australia. <laughs> Nothing changes. All right, next up, we're up against the, uh, we're up against Munster. And they are, they are in our group in pool 2, so we're off to a good start here. Um, big win. Yeah, there we go. Big season ahead, though. Pfft, big season ahead. So we've got to get those kits fixed. Um, and we've got to get... That's about it. Just the kits fixed for the uh, for the the Pro 14 teams. I'm just looking at our stats here. 70 passing now. 37 catching is really bad. Like, how is it that bad? We are 72 rated. Question is, though, what is the kit for... See, Munster's got the right kit. Yeah, so it's just a few of these teams that don't have the right kits. We have a quick look. Uh, we'll save that. Uh, we'll have a quick look at the uh, kits before we wrap up. Uh, Pro 14, where are they? Here they go. So, just Treviso. Oh, we just watched Treviso. They don't have the right kits. Uh, Cardiff. Have we scored another try? Yeah, 6.8. That would have been amazing. See, Cardiff have got the right kits. The numbers are a bit, again, not lined, but who cares? It looks good enough. Um, what else? Connor. They don't have the right... Okay, so I've got a few kits to get here. 
Uh, dragons, new pork green dragons. They didn't have the right kits either. Edinburgh. Edinburgh got the kits. So, yeah, we got half of them. We got half of them. We can sort that out. We can sort it out. Don't worry. Glasgow. Yes, I thought. So I remember getting this when they got the new logo. Uh, the lining up's a bit wrong, but I don't really care about that too much. Leinster, we should. Yeah, I thought we should have Leinster. I love that away kit. Holy hell, that's nice. Oof, that is a tasty kit. Uh, Munster. Oh, do we do have Munster? Yep. I like that away kit for Munster too. Jeez, we, I wish you could buy these kits everywhere. I'd buy that Munster away kit. That is beautiful. Ospreys. Yep, we got Ospreys. Like that. Scarlets. Oh, we got... Oh, I like that. Oh, that away Scarlets is quite nice. Uh, that alignment is way out on the back. Who cares, though? Not to worry. Still got the kit. That's nice. I like that. We got Scarlets. We don't have the Kings, which is surprising. Uh, Port Elizabeth. I'm going to look through that because... We got Portugal, obviously. Um, but aren't they normally called the Southern Kings? We'll see if there's Southern Kings like Super Rugby logos here. It's not. Okay. That's alright then. We will sort that out. It's three or four we've got to get, so that's not too bad. Not too bad. Uh, cheaters. Should have the Cheaters. Oh, what? We'll just use a curry cup uniform for the cheetahs though, let's be honest. Uh, Ulster. We've got Ulster. We've got the Irish boys. Uh, zebra. Ah, oh, I don't have Zebra as well. Okay. So what, there's about five there we don't have. That's alright, I'll fix them up for next time. Uh, Premiership. We should have Premiership teams here. We've got Bath. I won't go through all of these. Bristol, just to keep the, the main man himself happy. I like that Bristol kit. I like their little logo too. He's, he's chosen a very good team to support. We've got Exeter. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've got all the Premiership teams. Now, uh, who's the most obscure? London Irish? <laughs> I don't know. We've got all of them. So there we go. It's just a few Pro 14 teams we need to get. So we'll wrap them up and get them next time. Uh, but that's going to wrap me up, I think. Um, guys, thanks for stopping by. Thanks to those of you who have subscribed uh, today as well. Uh, you know, you've already seen the little alert. So if you do want to... Uh, help out the channel in any way while we stream, subscribe, or anything like that. You do get a nice cool alert. And I'm working on a cool video for members, um, Patreon subscribers. There's a few of you guys out there now. Uh, not subscribers, not normal subscribers. But your Patreon guys, your membership guys. Um, I've been working on a video for that. That should be hopefully coming out next week. Hopefully. So... Tune into that if you are a, a Patreon or a member uh, of the channel. And if you are, again, huge thanks to you guys out there. And everyone for just coming by and hanging out as well. Hanging out, saying hi, subscribing, um, following on Twitch if you guys have done that as well. It's awesome. We're on the road to 30. Um, Sam Lewis will be Monday. Probably probably later on Monday. Uh, because I'm going to leave it for the weekend. I'm going to give everyone a chance. No, not everyone watches videos straight away. I'll give everyone the chance of the weekend, so they'll have, you know, three days to pick where we want to go. Uh, and then I will select his team, where he's going to go, which looks like the Endrua at the moment, Fiji Endrua, on Monday. I'll do it Monday, uh, after the stream, probably. We'll do stream, and then um, I'll record some videos on Monday for it. And put one out Monday night, Tuesday. We'll see how we go. We'll see how we go for time. But, um, yes, be early next week. You can see that. So, tune into that. He's got a new club, most likely, at this rate. Um, so that should be fun. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, everyone who's come by uh, throughout the Eve, you guys through the chat. So big thanks for coming by and, and chatting and hanging out. Love it. We'll see you on. We'll see you tomorrow morning, actually. I'll try to come on tomorrow morning. Um, a Saturday morning stream. We might play more Max. I'll try to fix these kits tonight, and we can play some more Max. Uh, or whatever you guys want to... Whatever you guys want to see. We can do whatever. Saturdays are free days. Do whatever you like for two or three hours. We'll see how we go. Um, but until then, thanks for watching. Thanks to Tim by Daniel. I'll remember your name because it's much easier than North Melbourne. Um, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. And if not tomorrow, definitely Monday. But probably likely tomorrow. Actually, uh, yeah. Yeah, tomorrow. Yeah. We've got, we've got, we've got a, nice, um, a nice sugary beverage for tomorrow morning. So we'll be nice and away. That's me. Thanks, everyone. Big up to all you coming by. And I'll see you. I will see you tomorrow.
Till then, ta-ra. Good evening, good morning, good night, good afternoon, whatever it is. See you later.